right when bang welcome nice. back ball central podcast we have hey we're at 100 subscribers and i know i had to bring a special guest along for this episode we got myself john and elijah and special guest mr ibte lawrence how we doing how we doing i'm i'm doing good man doing good living Happy. the dream right john how you doing i'm doing good doing great Watching the NBA playoffs, uh, sometimes you get upset, sometimes you don't. You know, it's it's good basketball, though, so uh, doing good. But how about you, Elijah? Chilling, man. Feeling good right now. Oh. Hit, my, hit my line, bro. Oh, damn. Hit What's my that? line, monster. Hit my line. I don't condone that. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> have line, a better man. drink. Who what would you rather drink, Coca Cola or Monster? Come on, let's be real. My line. I was just throwing sponsorship. Yeah, my line. Yeah, my line. All right, all right. Here you go with the water. There you go. I'm gonna say this too, Logan. Logan Paul, bro, hit me. KSI, Logan Paul, hit me, bro. Listen, bro. I got options, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. The prime. Someone said that it tastes like it's been filtered through a jog strap. Is that true? No, sir. Okay. Oh, <laughs> they must not like coconut water. That that's probably what it is. I, yeah, no, I like because I like I like body armor. That's my second, like my second drink that I drink when I'm active and stuff. So right. My, so, my drink of choice right now is prime. My second go-to is well I think my main go-to is probably water. I'm not gonna lie. Essential okay. water. Okay. But prime is my 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 um energy. Boy, it's just off the top of your head. How how many uh, monsters do you think Elijah had today? Six. Uh, Whoa, damn, <laughs> damn, damn. The, way, the, way he, the way he push a monster, I don't know. Nah, this is the third one. Third one? Okay, okay. Third, okay. The night's not over. Oh, it, that's fast. You're, you're, you're right. Four? You're oh, right. I'm definitely I'm, I'm going to the gym after this. I might take another one. Elijah, <laughs> you think you've had more monsters or I've had more Cokes? You've had more Cokes. I just recently actually started drinking Monster back in January. That'd be a good guess, but tonight we're 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 even at three. I'm kind of trying to cut back with a little water. You got a whole race going on. I mean, a little water, like you said. Uh, I had um, I just started drinking monster in December though, so like it just started ramping up a little bit. You're brand new to the scene. I started ramping up, but yeah, we here, man. It's it's a it's a good drink. It really does it it does its job. (laughs) The crash, I'll be honest though, that crash is crazy. Like I had one. You'll be knocked out until next Saturday. I've had Monster once, and that was during high, uh, baseball in high school, and I almost rebooted after one sip. Did it help? I, no, I, yeah. I don't. I, I don't like it. Okay. I don't really I, drink energy drinks like that because I don't. I don't want to feel like some like I'm going crazy. I hear you. Like, I, I tried it in college. I was very. Uh, I I couldn't. You. I, it's all Coke or or just water or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. There it is. It's, okay. It's, so I'll, I'll be honest though. Oh, and I'm gonna cut you off right there, sir. So. We have a lot to go over. Yeah, we're just having a conversation. Yeah, bro. Be honest. Damn, Elijah, be honest. Yeah, yeah, Elijah. Yeah, Elijah. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. John, John, right. John got stuff. Florence got stuff. Do we really want to be here for another two hours? I mean, this is only two minutes. So, I mean, that's all I'm saying. We only three no, minutes and 30 we're seconds. Only three in, minutes bro. in. So, I mean, like. It's all right, though. It's all right. All right, though. We got to, you know, keep it pushing. We got to moderate. Understandable. <laughs> Understandable. Yeah, Although, but, uh, next time, I, I hope to hear Elijah. You know what I mean? That's all I'm saying. Silenced, but hey, not for hey, long. Just a reminder. Hey, man. They tried to the silence Martin Luther King, too. Shit. Shit. <laughs> I didn't. That wasn't me. Lawrence, you still have to deal with Still have to deal with Still have to deal with And he got a soundboard. <laughs> and he has a soundboard. So, if you my guy, noticed, my guy, yeah, to the if, you, if you if you haven't noticed from the title of this podcast, we're at 100 subscribers. We're at what 103, I believe, for right now. So, hey, shout out to everyone. I just especially want to say shout out to Lawrence. He's been a huge influence on the Ball Center podcast with help, yeah, help behind the scenes, advice, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So, I, I want to make sure he was on for today's show just to you know, show my appreciation. I'm sure the guys feel the same way. So, yeah, appreciate it. Sure. Elijah, can you get a round of applause for Lawrence on the <laughs> First of all, Phil, I'm not giving you shit. All right, oh, you cut me off like that. That's that's right. First of all, oh, you, you gotta, <laughs> we just can't people yeah. off now. Oh, nah, really? but oh, oh man. but what? Lord, you gotta finish well. your thing. This right. guy forgets so, 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 that I have powers too. He's got powers too. We can't shout out Lawrence. Oh, my God. Shout Lawrence. Shout <laughs> Lawrence. Yeah, nah, man. Anybody, anybody that's in my orbit, man, and I believe in you. I'm gonna help you out. Um, stuff that I learned um, that I had to go. grow in pains with. I'm gonna let let you know so you don't have to go through the same things that I had to go through. So, 
Yeah, also, make sure you check out IBT. All those links are going to be down below in this video. So shout, make sure you check them out. I'm also one of the hosts there. So, you know, double duty. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Fill, fill the man. Fill the man. All right. So we're going to, there's some small NFL news. So I know John wanted to talk about. So we're going to get right into it. Hell yeah. So Saquon Barkley's not going to play against the Giants ever again. So let's just go off of that. How could you so. say that? How could you say that? <laughs> so, John, tell us about the fight, the tag that he done. All right. Uh, Saquon is not thrilled about the tag, and I wouldn't be either. It's a one year. I mean, it's it's an inflated running back salary, which I don't think is high enough, personally. And uh, I think Saquon deserves some years, and I think he deserves some security. So, I mean, as a Giants fan, I stand behind him. I think that there still could be a deal getting done. Or he, he could end up signing the tag with – I don't know, convincing or if I don't know, maybe there there will be talks. I, I'm not 100 percent sure on what's going on. I'm not in any Giants meetings, so like as a fan looking in, it's just it's a little concerning because Saquon Barkley was such a spark last year. You know, what I mean? offense. Yeah. he was yeah. I mean, and he deserves to get paid. And so, so I mean, I I wanted to pay the guy, but at at the time period of the the, the tag versus signing with Daniel Jones, it just made sense to tag Barkley realistically, but. I can I can see how he doesn't want the tag. What do you guys think about it? I I'm 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 behind Barkley. Period. Um, fully. Uh, pause. Period. But, um, <laughs> nah, I him and Lamar, bro. Like I know, understand now. After watching what happened with Earl Thomas and the Seahawks, why you don't mm-hmm. want to sign that tag? Because if you you're mm-hmm. betting on yourself, basically, if you take that tag, you're betting on yourself yeah. to produce and be able to get that long term contract. You're but the team is also low key showing that they don't believe in you. Yeah. And if if you get hurt playing under that tag, you're fucked for the next contract. So I I respect both of their decisions and I wouldn't sign either. And that's what I mean, happened to Drew Brees too. Like when he was with the Chargers, he signed that one year deal and then he got hurt at the end of the year and they didn't even know if he could play and they didn't they just went with Philip Rivers. You know what I mean? And it's the greatest thing ever. I mean, that's the greatest thing ever for you, my guy. I mean, that's especially <laughs> he went, he went out, he went no out and had a crazy 16 year career. I that's wouldn't have it any other way. I mean, yeah. he killed it. Yeah, I mean, I respect I respect anybody's decision on what they want to do, but as for we're talking about Barkley right now mm-hmm. specifically, mm-hmm. I wouldn't sign that shit either. I hope he doesn't sit out the year because I do think it, it takes it, it took away a little bit from Le'Veon Bell. It takes a little bit away well, from definitely the playoffs. Definitely not make the playoffs if you don't play this year. I mean, they're definitely not gonna make the playoffs. I mean, I'm not even talking about that. I'm talking about Saquon as a as a player in general. He needs like, to get paid, yeah. He needs to get paid. He needs to the more you stay into the sport, the better you are at that sport. So it just I don't know. I hope I hope they get something done and he gets paid. They need to. Yeah. Damn, what's up with New York athletes trying to sign, you know? Aaron Rodgers, now Saquon just like two different situations, my guy. Aaron well, Rodgers, I like to see it. Aaron Rodgers is Aaron Rodgers is great. He's Aaron good. Rodgers is signed already. Basically. This is all yeah. the Packers. The Packers yeah, yeah. are just wanting too much right now. They can't afford him and love on the same contract. So I mean, like, they're not getting our first round pick. And Aaron Rodgers <laughs> even basically said this week, he was like, take your time. I'm not even gonna be in the facility. Like in May, like why would no, I? I'm gonna be in the darkness cave, whatever it is. No, I mean he's he, there's already videos of him and Lazard training, so I mean, but, I'm we're, I'm happy. Like I don't we're, care. We're also I, talking about the fact that the Packers are basically saying if we don't get what we want, we're gonna let him rot. But like y'all now gotta pay this man sixty million dollars to do nothing. Like that's a lot of fucking money. And they didn't move money this off season. We move money. You know what exactly. I mean? So we can afford him. I'm not gonna. Money. I'm that's not good. gonna lie to you about the Jets, man. Don't let Aaron Rodgers come there. Oh, really? You're against like, it? Yeah, it's letting the wolf into the chicken coop. Your team is going to get decimated. He's already tried. He's already trying to take uh, Garrett Wilson in the backseat. Elijah Moore is out of there. He's trying I to. Think so. He's going to bring Randall Cobb there. It's going to be the same receiving core for the Packers. That's all I get. That. I don't First think. And I, and I and I and I don't. I hate that. As soon I as they still get Cobb. I mean, I don't know. I don't, I don't know where he's, way. Gonna, he's I gonna mean, get Cobb. I mean, if they need depth, sure, but. There, there are a lot of receivers on there. This is the first time he's ever thrown to a first round pick. All right. He's never thrown to a first round pick. Yeah, so, true. I mean, Corey Davis and Wilson. So, I mean, it's just like, I'm excited. He wasn't a first rounder? What? He wasn't a first rounder? No. Uh, who wasn't a first rounder? Sorry. Was no, I don't think no, so. No, he was a second rounder. Probably. Yeah. Which was crazy. Round. Like, a, insane steal at that price. And he also waited another year. So, I think. They, the Packers didn't do their job last year, and they're not doing their job this year, all right? And if you're wasting potential draft picks and years, that's going to affect your team. It's not going to help Jordan Love. It's going to hurt him. So, I mean, 
Right. Do you? I think the craziest thing is that I know the Jets are going to give them two first rounders. They just want 13 this year, and they're not getting it. I mean, it is it is what it is. If if you really, as the Jets, if you really believe in Aaron Rodgers, I mean, this is this is Joe Douglas and Robert Sala's jobs on the line. It's them making this move, realistically. Because you already didn't develop Zach Wilson. So, I mean, if you bring in Aaron Rodgers, I mean, that might be good for Zach Wilson. Him and Zach Wilson have practiced together, and Zach Wilson kind of likes Aaron Rodgers. So, I mean, like, I or he, is, if he's there for a year or two, I mean, you could – Ride out Zach Wilson's rookie contract and see what he has. I mean, or he can compete for the job. They're not giving up on him either. That's one of the things they've been saying. So it's like, it's interesting to see what happens. But right, and we also got <laughs> other news as well. OBJ is a Raven. So yeah. uh, <laughs> how do you feel about it? How do you feel about it? <laughs> I mean, congrats. You got you know your insanity. Yeah, it's like where, where's the bars money at now? Eighteen mil, one year, eighteen mil, right, Lawrence? For, yeah, for one, one for 15, and then it's up to 18. With Ooh. incentives. Yeah. Damn. For a guy that has a uh, repeated destroyed knee, on, I don't get it. And out last year. The, you don't know? It, it's, a sell, it's a sell tickets. That's that's what it no, is. No, it's not even that. You don't know? Odell's like a big brother to Mar Jackson. Like that. I mean, I'm just saying. Like, if you can play with, if you, I mean, I get that. I mean, you. it is what it is. If you want to believe – the, the stories, you believe the stories. You know what I mean? If you believe this guy can get you to a Super Bowl and you can get paid, play on that $32 million. I don't – I think that's – they're underpaying the shit out of him, personally. Like, I think – I think – like, I what I want from Lamar Jackson is guaranteed money. I want what he wants, and I want him to sign because the, the dude is great talent. You know what I mean? But – He should he should get like, – to be honest, Deshaun Watson swooped in and stole his contract. You think? To be I honest, mean, yeah. I mean, I, there, let me ask you this. There's a lot of talk about the Bengals throwing a contract to Joe Burrow soon. Throw it down for guaranteed money. Spend 20 extra million dollars on a guy you're already going to spend a lot of money on. There's no way they're not going to extend Joe Burrow. So why not give him a guaranteed deal and force Baltimore to do it? You know what I mean? Like you're it, you're or, literally. Or, are you saying either or? If Baltimore does it first. It forces Joe Burrow's hand. Then Joe Burrow has to get rid of his, some of his weapons. No, I'm because... saying. I'm saying Joe Burrow's like re-signing's already down the line. Like it's like two, you still got like two, three years until yeah. like we're really talking about full of money, right? So what I'm saying is like you get that done early. You you one probably underpay what you're gonna already pay to the guy. You know what I mean? And then on top of it, like Lamar Jackson's gonna be so pissed in Baltimore, he's not gonna want to come back. But I mean he's well, he's he's not going, he's not going to play. If you don't you know, think so? I think he's he is. out. He is. A lot of people. A lot of people he's, have said. I mean, I don't know. It's gonna he's be not going. He's not going to play. He's uh, already played. He's already played the loyalty card already. He's already done it. I know, but I just I I you saw them in Miami, right? Miami. Well, who? Lamar Jackson and uh, Odell Beckham Jr. At yeah. Disney World. No, no like in a nightclub, like like oh, the yeah, night so. of the signing. Like I'm I'm telling you, Odell and Lamar are really good friends. So I just, I just, I just think, Nelson Aguilar is your second best receiver. I don't know. I just think listen, I, mean, I think Odell yeah, got good relationships with everybody. He's just a likable he does. person. He and does. He's, he's a pretty much a celebrity over a football player at this point. But what I'm so saying, like, like to you guys, it's like, why would he sign if Lamar's not coming back? You know what I'm saying? To get paid. I mean, in a way, the only thing that offered that much money. I, I know, but I th- I think there's somewhere Lamar talked to him and like yeah I'll be back or I mean, you're coming. Yeah, up. lied to him. Try to get, no, I'm I'm guessing he lied to him. Try to get him that money he wanted because no no one team was gonna throw him that much money. Okay, understandable. In my yeah. opinion, no. I mean I think the Ravens are dying to match an offer. Anyways, you know what I mean? I think the problem <laughs> is Lamar is representing himself and there hasn't been an offer already on the table because this guy mm-hmm. deserves an offer. You know what I mean? Like he deserves guaranteed money. The Ravens are gonna match it anyways. He's He's it's it's insane. It's insane what's going on right now because like why you're, they're gonna give up two first round picks for absolutely nothing. Just give this guy guaranteed money. <laughs> right. like, I, you know what I mean? Like, are we like are we what are we doing here? Like, uh, all right, my turn. Okay, sorry. Right. Like, it's my my oh damn. Sorry, I like yeah, my, bro. my bad. I'm sorry. I should have passed <laughs> I, over. You got to be authentic when it's Skip Bayless things. Bow. It's on. my turn. All right. Stop. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say honestly, Deshaun Watson definitely ruined Lamar Jackson. Deshaun Watson signed a two hundred thirty million dollar fully guaranteed contract. Went out two. there and played like shit. Didn't he get two fifty? No, I think it was two thirty. Was it two thirty? It, it went down or whatever. They readjusted it a little bit. Oh, okay, okay. That's probably must have. Been. Either I, way, I thought initially it was a quarter quarter billion. It might have been quarter billion. Yeah. <laughs> that's Additional. around. That's around where Lamar's supposed to be getting paid. Two thirty. Two thirty guaranteed. Two thirty guaranteed. 
That's a where that's around where Lamar's supposed to be getting paid. Deshaun Watson yeah. went out there and played like shit. Now the Ravens are probably looking at that saying, Well, I'm not gonna have to give you two thirty because you might play like shit after that. We don't know. Well he, he played he only yeah. played he he only played four or five games though. True, uh, but the Ravens and, just like yeah. like John also said, Joe Burrow's about to get his deal. The rest of minus the Steelers, because they're ass. But the rest of the NFL, um, <laughs> the rest of the Steelers, AMs, Steelers is always, Steelers is always going to get eight and nine wins. They go. Mike Tomlin will find. Mike Tomlin will something. Will that team get those wins? But I'm yeah. saying like the rest of the AFC North has their has their quarterbacks locked down. Yeah, if, if Lamar leaves, they're going back to they're going to the shadow they're room. Bottom feeders again. Yeah, yeah they're about to. It's, it's a wrap. Elijah, can I and ask you a question? I would, say this. <laughs> I would say this. I know. I I got you, John. Give me one okay. second. Okay, I, got you. I do think that Odell signing was a Lamar saying, yeah, I'll be back. But I do think Lamar is going to sit out until about week seven, eight. Ravens going to be like three and five, two and six. He going to come back and will them to some type of win. I'm like some all, type all of winning record. Is, all Maybe he does a is wild card berth. And so now you got to give him money. <laughs> yeah. And it's going to look like it's going to look real ugly because they can't tag him again next year. Yeah. They, they took that out of the CBA, didn't they? Yeah, they, they can't they, tag they, him twice. In, can't in, tag in him two years one. in a row. Yep. So y'all don't the player, pay the him player. Now. The player said. The player said, "Fuck that shit. We getting that out of there." <laughs> that's smart. That's to be honest, it's smart for them to do that though. Super smart. They got they got tired of that shit getting just franchise franchise, and they want to wait wait for you to get hurt. That's how the NFL is too. Like some people may not believe it that they're these teams are. They look out for the players. They don't. They don't care about these players. You can see it from the running back position. Demarco Murray. Demarco Murray was due for money. They said, "All right, we're gonna tag you." What they do? He touched the ball four hundred and seventy-five times. His body's broken, and he can no longer get his money. He was done out of the league at 26, 27 years old. It's insanity. It's crazy. And it was so, like again, I'm bringing up Earl Thomas. Even, even uh, Sa- that- yeah, yeah. Even Saquon too. Like Saquon should not sign that. He, the injuries he had, and then the season, he bounced back. He literally was one of the run, the best offensive players in the league last season. Sit he out. Was, my fault, but he was like no, no. fantasy RB1 or 2 last year. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. And he was taking like fantasy RB3. Like realistically, we're talking about taking Saquon where people took him. Like he yeah. slid. He yep. slid to the second round in our yeah. draft. Yeah. Nobody yeah. wanted to touch him. Yeah. Picked him up. He was averaging like 26, 27 a game. He was. That's a whole. That's all a whole right. fact. Here, John, what's your question? Okay, my question was: All right, it would never happen, and it like it, it's almost insulting to say it because Kenny Pickett's on the team. But if Pittsburgh didn't have a quarterback, who gives a fuck? Put three hundred million on the table and give him two oh, first. Three hundred oh, million. My, I'm just oh, saying. Oh, oh, three hundred million. You can only you can guarantee like like. Yeah, they have that. They. Have they I mean, you can stay in it. You can, you can void years. I'm not going to lie there's a, to you. There's a bunch of things you can do to it. I'm not going to lie to you. Lamar Jackson on the Pittsburgh Steelers. Would be insane. Oh, my goodness. Would be insane. And, and the reason you I have, have, you, have, have a, you have yeah. everything you need. You got you have a tight end. You got, you got fire move. You got, you got George. You got George. Najee Harris? Every, he, uh, George can run every route. That's got to put that O-line. Jump balls, contested catches, and then Deontay Johnson is yo. Running. That is so, scary. Yeah. But hey, that it's it's gonna be far fetched though, because yeah. still Steelers ain't known. They ain't known for that. Yeah. Plus, I think they do. They still need to spend some money on that old line because that one is tr- horrendous. Yeah. I know, the, but wouldn't it be the old line actually is not that bad in Pittsburgh? Last They're year. mid. They're yeah. mid. They could be. better. I think if they had an experienced quarterback there, it'd be so much better. It takes time to develop. You're gonna run away every play. <laughs> I think I say I say that too about like the NBA players too. Like give them time to cook. Like linemen, there's just some freak linemen that come in that are really like that. But the offensive linemen, you got to give them time to mess to really people. yeah to mess with the the line that they're playing with. And you got to remember they're facing people that are six four, six five, running four threes, running so like, straight at them. Yeah, yeah. And they're linemen and, and linebackers. You know yeah. different. Guys. So it's just like a different. You got to you got to take that into account. Like the athletes on defense is just super super crazy now. Also, I'm glad you brought up linebackers. Devin White is looking to get out of Tampa Bay. Where, where do you think he's going to head to now that you know he wants out of there? I'm surprised. Um, well, Mike Evans and Godwin didn't want to trade either. So where do we see him going, Devin White? Maybe Buffalo because they just did a slot at Tra- Tremaine Evans. Where he going to uh, go? Possibility? I mean, maybe. What if, if well, really I was going to say God, Godwin and Godwin and um, Evans. They're probably under contract. They probably. They're probably not gonna eat that um eat the that money like that. 
But um, Devin, I don't know why. He, he's still I, young I, too, I'm gonna be, right? I'm gonna be completely he's, honest. He it's like his fourth, fifth year in the league. Mind you, I get, to, I got to watch him. I got to watch him a lot, a lot, a lot. He's not that good. Oh, he's not that good. Okay, I'm just saying he could be a Thank quarter you. piece. Thank you, because I was gonna say that he's not that because you got to think about who he has next to him. He's one of the smartest Check. linebackers in the league. He's one of the best. He's a tackle machine. He gets everybody lined up. Unsung hero on that defense. Like you got to think about it. Like that who, who he's playing with. He's he's a he's a he's a gambler at linebacker too. He he's is. Super, he's fast. He can get. He can make the tackles. But he he messes up a lot of a lot of plays. So, and that's just me. I'm a Saints fan, so I got the I got the watch. <laughs> you got to say. I got to I got to watch him when he got the he, film, yeah. So you he don't did. care. You you're excited just because this guy he's out of your division, yeah. He's out of your division. Yeah, no, nah, I listen. Well, we, we're good at linebacker right now, but if, yeah. if we if we had to fill that spot, I would take him. But I'm saying that the height to where he ain't no Bobby Wagner type. Oh no, no, no. Like, no Bobby sure. Wagner, you talk, yo, where yo, what you where you going? Like well, Bobby Wagner also like people like him and Von Miller, since like that comparison of they both signed with the Rams, like Two different players, you know what I mean? Like yeah. they play way differently, you know what I mean? So if he fits your scheme, he's gonna do amazing. But I mean, Bobby Wagner, like I don't know. Go back to Seattle, it's crazy. Yeah, Is he really? Like, yeah, yeah Bobby, Bobby Wagner went back to Seattle. Back to Seattle. Seattle. I did not yeah. know. He's okay. doing a farewell, a farewell season, I believe. Cool. Yeah. Saying, oh, the Rams aren't shit. I'm, I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> Maybe two more. They can make the playoffs. Uh, I'm gonna say this about Devin White though. I think he's like the Trayvon Diggs of linebackers. Like you just said, he's a gambler <laughs> for real, bro. Damn. But. Yeah. A smart place for him to go would actually either be Buffalo or Kansas City. Get out of the NFC for one. Especially I, was thinking, I was thinking KC, but Buffalo too. And Buffalo, then they, they just lost um they just lost Edmonds. Yep, Tremaine did. Yeah, they just lost Edmonds. They, they are, are they willing, somebody. Yeah. That too, or are you willing to he's probably gonna want and he's gonna probably want new money too. So well, another place he could go is also, I'm gonna just say this. This might be a little crazy, but Atlanta. Cause they bolstering that whole defense. Don't, don't say it, Dolores. Don't, don't, don't say, say that. that. I'm yeah. sorry. I'm I'm sorry. I'm a very I'm a very unbiased they already, they, analyst. You feel me? They already, I don't think they, they, already, do they already took our you. They already took our best defensive tackle and got now we got to face him twice a year. It's, I'm just it's saying. Not good. It's and, got, and they got Akuda for cheap. But no, I can see that though. That's I probably that's probably Atlanta what's gonna happen. Atlanta be a great move for him. Yeah. But how much would Atlanta give up? You know what I mean. Atlanta, Atlanta they, got, they got cap. They got, they got, cap, they got money. They, they do, got but... plenty of cap, and they got plenty of picks. Okay. They just need to find a QB. I think Atlanta needs to find a QB. He, hello, and, Mark uh, Jackson, but whatever. I think it's, it's, sad, it's sad as me to say this, but Ritter, Ritter's got some – he's got some promise. I, he does have promise, but I think they need – I think they need – an experience. I think that – yeah, I think they need some experience. I think they should have been after Jimmy G or Derek Carr a little harder. Okay. Nah, nah, okay. Derek Carr could come over here, man. <laughs> the, the pain it, I just the pain no. I just watched for seventeen games, eighteen I'm games. I'm telling you right no now, <laughs> Derek said, Carr about to let New Orleans down. Why? Really? I'm gonna say that right now, bro. Talk to y'all you. are about to be real disappointed. Y'all right, finish. Lawrence, I think y'all. I think y'all win you, the. Div- Actually, I don't even think y'all win the division. <gasps> this is okay. I think Carolina wins that division. Carolina yeah. wins the division. Okay. With a rookie quarterback? Yes, sir. Yeah, he's gonna get eaten alive. He's gonna be and if they they better go get CJ Stroud. But whoever gets Bryce Young, he's gonna get crunched in his body. Bryce Young is not the answer. I'm gonna say that. Yeah, I agree. He's Bryce going, Young is not the answer. Fra- he is frail, bro. He's about he's about 5'11", 185. He gets Ooh. hit by one of the defensive linemen. Uh, Bryce Young is not the answer. He I don't know. CJ, I, listen. I think CJ Stroud is a is a better prospect than him. That's you gotta. Be, it's it's a hard. I'm just saying it's hard to get that job what? at quarterback at Alabama. That's all I'm saying. Like I, I I'm giving the guy a chance before he gets crunched. You know yes. what I mean? Like if he has no offensive line, yeah, that's what's gonna happen. You know what I mean? But I don't know. I, let's give the guy a chance. You don't think? Hey, no, I'm, I like him. I like him. Though. I'm just saying that as far as the stature and frame. Okay, I'm just saying if he, because if he Florence, can, you know, every 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 year they take four quarterbacks. There's one that's gonna be a complete bust. You know what I mean? And it might be. It's gonna be Will Levis. It's gonna be Will. Okay. You might well, wait, a side note. But in a, but in a couple yeah. years, we might we might end up being wrong about him. We might end up Yo, being wrong. Another segue. Okay. No, no. He's, he's, he's getting the same Zach Wilson hype, bro. He's not it. 
He made one good throw on a pro day. No pads on, no defense. I don't believe in pro day videos. After Zach Wilson, I don't believe in pro day videos. <laughs> After so, Zach Wilson. Uh, uh, I didn't believe in Zach Wilson's pro day video. I didn't want this nigga. Yeah, I understand. Um, <laughs> Wait, side note. We could change I, the I, subject. Go ahead. Yeah, since Segway, since we we're going we're gonna to Segway this episode, and I felt pre draft talk since John wanted oh, to talk yeah. about it as well. So, we just, hey, we're on a roll with Segway today. Just I mean, I had to ask thing. you guys, had to, I mean, had to see what's up with it. I mean, we're, we're talking NFL draft. What do, who, anyone you're looking forward to? Who, who do you think is going to be the number one overall pick? We think it's CJ Stroud. Is that what it, where it's going? It got to be I, CJ. I think CJ Stroud. We got to put money is, on it. I'm just saying. Is, outside of, <laughs> outside of, outside of the defense alignment, obviously. You got Jalen Carter. You got Will Anderson. Um, this is a, there's a bunch of talent outside of the quarterback for the first time in years. Well, that's what I'm saying. We got we got what four? We there's only been four quarterbacks that have been talked about in previous years. That shit is usually nine or ten. Where sure. they're like you, oh, you got to get these guys. Sure. But now is is pretty loaded to where a lot of teams they can fill some holes. There's a lot of teams that don't even need quarterbacks. Because the old fossils are leaving the league, sure. And other guys are stepping up too. So, and there um, there are second and like second round, third round, fourth round. There are people, there are guys that come out of those positions. You know what I mean? That are just overlooked. You know what I mean? For whatever yeah. reason. Brady. Um, I, I like I like CJ Stroud, man. As as okay. far as the quarterbacks go, um, he's got the build. He has the arm. Um, he has he had the moments we seen when he played. He had a chance to play Georgia. And he took them down to the to the wire. So I'm gonna say this: I, I think, I I think like, he's got the heart, and that's a hard Georgia team. Let's just be honest. Yeah. This is they're, be, they're the best, the best defense ever in college football history. Uh, right? I, no, 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 by numbers, by numbers, by numbers, by numbers. I just, by I, numbers, ever. I get that, but like games also <laughs> games change a little bit. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's true. That's true. If, we, if we're really facing people from two different ends, I mean, <laughs> Miami Hurricanes defense. I'm just, I'm just, I don't know. Yeah, Maybe not. Yeah. But. Um, I would say I like CJ as the number one pick. I think he Anthony does. Richardson's yeah. coming off the board number two. Okay. Um, yeah. I'm scared. I, I'm scared. I'm scared about him though. He's a he's a he's a he's a he's like um he's like a Cam Newton prospect. Where it's like, yo, this dude is is crazy. Hopefully, oh, different fashion sense. Like, but the thing is, they don't know about him. They don't. I don't think there's enough tape on him to be like, yo, quarterback might be it. You feel me? So I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah, he, only, think, he only played one, what, one full season, right? Which was last season. I think so, yeah. Yeah, so I yeah, think he comes off the board. Second second got drafted. Um, Mitchell Trubisky got drafted off a of season. Oh. So <laughs> there, there's Will Livis's uh there's his comparison right there. Mitchell Trubisky is a perfect comparison. And I'm and I, I watched Carolina a lot that, that season. That um they um Mitchell Trubisky, I think that was Michael Carter. That was Michael Carter, yep. and who was the other running back from North Carolina that year? They had a two-headed monster. Michael Carter was really young, though. Yeah, I don't I think Michael year. Carter was. I think he might have been a freshman that year. Fuck, who was it? I'm trying to think. Oh, they, they had two running backs, but I watched them, and when when I got to the draft time, and I saw Mitchell was going top five. I said, "Whoa, they're trending. number two, bro." I said, "No, there's no you way." Check his drink. They're yeah, they're about to regret this because I watched him Chicago. for like four or five uh, NCAA games. So, Chicago, Lower State, mind taking that nigga too, bro. Patrick, they I'll traded. Nobody was taking him, and they traded up from ten to two. I think it was at ten. I don't remember, but. Go ahead. And boys, you know I'm excited about the Jets pick because we got 13. And if four quarterbacks go in the first, like in the first 10 picks, that's a top 10 pick. First five, you know picks. what I mean? First five, I mean that's first a, that's five. A, I mean that's a top 10 pick. You know what I mean? You're getting you're getting other talent, which is awesome. We need it to tackle. We need other people. You know what I mean? Like, it, we're if we're you know what I mean? We're bringing in an experienced quarterback, so we need to add a piece. So I'm excited. But yeah, O line is our main concern right now. And... Mm-hmm. I say, how, do you feel, mean, how do you feel about New York teams, by the way? What uh, you said, the Saints? How do you feel about New York teams? Of oh, New York team. I'm not a fan of New York teams. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry yeah. about it. I I'm mean, it's okay. Because, it, like, because for me, right, when you grow up and you just like, like competitively, like I used to do. I'm, I'm still obsessed with winning and just okay. doing great shit. And then okay. just growing up, we just watched New York teams, and they just didn't win. 
Yeah, I mean, like what? Eli Manning, like beating an undefeated Patriots <laughs> bro, team. I mean, bro, I'm just saying, bro, like, yeah. it's crazy up in here. Bro, like, you said Eli Manning. I mean, Eli Manning. I mean, I mean, start naming, start naming the people that matter when you talk about them chips. I mean, I hear you. I hear you. NASCAR, NASCAR, right NASCAR, NASCAR, Eli Manning NASCAR, matters. They Eli changed. Manning matters. Listen, I will say this though: the the Giants, the Giants changed the NFL as far as defensive line. They when did. they started putting two defensive te- uh, defense alignment or edge rushers at D tackle, mm-hmm. that changed the whole dynamic of the yep. league. The whole dynamic, because you had Michael Strahan, he was at the end of his years, and then he would get some guy. They would draft a bunch of guys, and then they come and give them a give them a breather, and then they still going crazy. I think they called it NASCAR. I can't remember. That's I what, can't that's remember what the formation was. Who who is that defensive coordinator? He's the defensive coordinator for the Chiefs now. Spagnola. Spagnoli, yeah. Spagnoli. He, he, I love he, it. He, he let him on coach, defense. Uh, the Lions, too, I believe. Yeah, right and the Rams, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to make a joke about the Jets. He got brought up about the Jets. Yeah. It's just a giant Super Bowl. I mean, so, it, it was what it was. It's okay. Don't worry about it. <sighs> well, well, wait, and then, let's just also talk about the fact that it didn't happen once, Bill. It did happen twice. Yeah. Mario <laughs> Manningham sideline catch of pain. Um and then two two names I want to I name too for the draft for the draft as far as receivers go, um is at uh, Jordan Addison uh, from USC played with Caleb okay. Williams he's a okay. he's a beast he's gonna be a, a really good slot receiver and then the best receiver in the draft is Jackson, really Jackson from Ohio State so okay yeah is, 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 he, is he though yeah there are a lot of wide receivers though yeah there's, there's a lot of wide receivers. How are we thinking about Robinson I'm going to top trying 10? trying to think of the guy. name is slipping my mind. You talking about the guy from TCU? Yeah, I'm not, talking about, Johnston? I'm uh, talking about uh, the guy from Texas. Robinson? Oh, BJ. Uh, back. BJ, BJ. Yeah, That's who I'm yeah. talking about, too, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh no, he's I, a I, running back. He's a running back. I know, I know, but oh, how do you right, feel about him going yeah, top yeah, 10? Yeah. Um, running back should not go top 10. That's, That's what I'm saying. The running back, listen, I'm a former running back, so – I'm always gonna you. have I'm always gonna have a special place in my heart for the running backs. Okay. The running back shit is crazy because you need them. Um they're there, they're always there when you need them, but then when they look look back to you, you don't got them. So I think he's a I think he's a uh I, I said it in pre-pro is I think he's a close comparison to what um Saquon Barkley was doing at Penn State. Um a lot of a lot of the runs, his balance is crazy. Um, he runs with power. He has ev- he has everything as far as a running back. When you go and pick from the pile, he has everything all in one. He has power, speed, elusiveness. He's definitely um, a first he round pick. Catch. He can okay. pass, bro. I, I don't. No, I think I think it's yeah. it's he's a first round pick. I think first round pick. Yeah, he's but... a first round pick. But what happens in the draft? Some of these teams, you got needs, and the needs True. come off the board. You take True. the best available player. Like if you can upgrade at a position that is man. And their players there, and then your position that you really need it, and you don't, yeah, nobody's graded high enough. You take the best player. I just, I just oh, hear the Eagles the looking for him. And I just, what is the draft? Um, at the end of this month, twenty seventh. Yeah, end of this month. Yeah. I, I just, I, I just see the Eagles looking at him, and like they don't need him. You know what I mean? Like I guess they do need him. You said the Eagles? Yeah, that he's rumored. A lot of people. Uh, listen, the listen. listen. They did lose Miles Sanders, but they just um, got Chris Carson. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just let, me, let me t- let me. And I got they got um Rashard Penny. They also got Rashard Penny. They got who's the Giants? Chris Carson retired. Chris Carson, Chris Carson retired. retired. Oh, Chris Penny. Carson retired. I'm talking about yeah, Rashard Penny. Penny. My bad. My bad. I, why did I confuse him? My bad. I will say this about the Eagles, though, man. And Eagles fans, man, they just <laughs> want everybody. They do because they it's in it's in striking distance for them. And I'm gonna be honest here. I'll be honest, all the quarterbacks, Joe Burrow, Justin Herbert, Lamar, Pat Mahomes, is in that conversation. He's in that yeah, conversation. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm yeah. getting to what I'm about to say. Oh, sorry, it, my bad. The window, sorry, the, window, the window is closing really fast. You think there's a window? You think it's closing? Yeah, there's like there's definitely a window. There's I mean, there's a window. I mean, is there a window? That's what I, I yeah. mean. I don't yes. know. Okay. Because, right. There is a window because I'm just that, saying that when you go to when you go to a Super Bowl, the yeah. only team in NFL, no, there's two teams now. Okay, there's two teams that actually reload and actually be able to do it. It's the mm-hmm. Patriots mm-hmm. because they didn't pay anybody and they played with janitors at wide mm-hmm. receiver. Okay, and then you got the Chiefs. Okay, the Eagles 
are disintegrating before our eyes. If you think, well, I mean, it, I hope they are. I hope they are. They're, I'm a they're, Giants they're fan, trickling, so they're, there's going to be is this year with some people that got that. Oh, we're not signing them back. Oh, we're not signing them back. And then you got Fletcher Cox is getting old. Brandon Graham sure. is, is holding on for dear life. Sure. Can, Justin Kelsey it, came out of retirement to play. You know what I mean? Yeah, He's so playing. Like, right. I mean, if, I mean, if they can reload, like they have enough young core to reload, but. <laughs> the league is going to start catching up to what Jalen Hurts and them do. You uh, can't run RPO out of the same formation. I get that. That shit next year, that shit next year is done. The I NFL, the, the, NFL off. <laughs> the NFL, like we watched, we watched um, RG3. We watched RG3. Oh, don't compare go, him to RG3. No, no, no. I'm talking about RG3 right. went crazy on the he league. Did. And what happened the following year? He couldn't he do hurt. nothing. He got hurt. He got hurt. I'm saying, yeah, he still, but he still had, he still struggled when he was playing. But it's just yeah. like, I think that's, I think that's what's going to happen. Gonna happen? Yeah, I think, because if you have enough tape on somebody, you can adjust. That's how I, you're I understand that, but like what I'm saying is, I think I think Hertz is almost in that conversation of top five elite quarterbacks. Like, I mean, maybe you don't think that whatsoever, but I think he's a young guy who 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 was successful at running the ball and he was successful at passing. They could people couldn't stop the Eagles. Yeah, listen, J- and I'm, I'm a Giants I, fan. I don't. You think I want this to be the case? Like, you think going, I, you want me to get this? To- Going like, back to Oklahoma, going back to Oklahoma, Alabama. I love Jay Lawrence. I love okay, everything cool, that cool. he does. All of that. I'm just saying it's just the reality of the league. But let like, me tell you the reality of this situation. They're the only NFL team within five years to win two Super Bowls. And you know what I mean? With two different head coaches, with two different starting quarterbacks, you know what I mean? To go to two, two Super Bowls. Oh, to, to go, go to two Super Bowls. My oh. bad. Sorry. To go to two Super Bowls. I'm just saying, like, they retooled enough to do it again. You know what I mean? What can they do it for a third time? I mean, what I'm saying is, I think he's so young that if he if he doesn't if he's not injury prone, like if he's not if he doesn't turn out like RG three and he doesn't hurt his legs, you know what I mean? Because I think yeah. he's an elite passer. Like he can he can be in the league for 12, 15 years. That's and I think I think that's you said it. You said an elite passer. I think I think he still needs to work on it, but like oh. I think this yeah, year he's taking he he's taking a giant I think, step. I, he's taking yeah, a yeah, giant yeah. step. I mean, no, I'm no. What it was, we saw more. We saw more. He got more opportunity. Sure, he so had to get. We, we didn't, he, the previous season, we didn't have a good sample size to go off of. And I now mean, we, he got, also, we got to see him throw the ball down the field a little bit more. Even Super he Bowl, got he, played, he played. He got pieces. He played tremendous in the Super Bowl. He did. He did. I thought, you know, oh. The ball. Uh, I'm gonna right. say this real quick though. Eagles fans, just be prepared for a big setback this year. I hope so. Y'all not winning that division. Hey, it's, oh, it's wait, tough. Elijah, where's your, where's your face paint? At? Who's winning the division? Who's winning the division? Dallas. Okay, I don't believe that. I hope so. I think, I think Dallas, Dallas, Dallas I think is doing going, more than the Eagles this offseason. What's I think going on? I think it'll be Dallas, New York, Philly. I hope it's New York, personally. I mean, personally, I hope it's New York. Personally. Oh, but like, <laughs> know. I mean, duh. But, like, what I'm saying is, like, what I'm saying is, like, if we, build, if we build off of what we did last year and we oh, add more people, like, more offensive weapons, who's I think the, we can compete with the quarterback for Washington? What'd you say? Who's the quarterback for Washington? Sam I Howell. think it's – Sam Howell, no, technically. I, I thought it was – um, what's his name? It's got, technically um, Sam Howell. Sam Howell and – Bursette. What nope. what pick oh, do Jacoby they have? Brissett is in that quarterback room in Washington now. He is, yep. yeah. He is. What what pick do they have? Top, they're top five, I think. No, they're not. They're top ten. They should be. They're oh, they're sixteen. Sixteen. Someone falls. Yeah. If someone falls, they take him. Or they they take another I quarterback. That, I think that's what. It, yeah. I think they're gonna see what Sam Howell has this year. They're okay if they tank because. Okay. Well, because. Well, well, I, I like your beat. Another that. another Tar Heel quarterback, right? I believe so. Right. Hey, we'll find out. We got some other topics. I, well. I think he's better than I think he's better than Mitch. So, so end end of, end of the month is going to be the draft. Hey, a lot of moves can be made. And also, Aaron Rodgers probably will still will still will still be a Packer. So we'll see how that goes. So we doing uh mm-hmm. we doing mock drafts. We could down the road, yeah. We could maybe kick because I, I think remember we we did, we did like what a year ago, two years ago in person, Lawrence. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was that was, so. that was fun and shit. So we also got some NBA to talk about. Um. So obviously the end, end of the season's here. Who's everyone's picks for all the awards? MVP, IP, et cetera, et cetera. Because everyone's debating about MVP. Uh let's go off with the easy ones. Uh, coach of the year. Mike Brown. Mike Brown. Mike Brown. Mike Brown. Easy. We don't, we don't, we don't take consensus, yeah. We don't take shit from nobody. Sorry, sorry. I like that. <laughs> I, I like that, that too much. I love that, and, that press conference. Yeah, Bucks coach watch his player get choked out. <laughs> yeah, Bucks coach did what they're supposed to do. Nuggets coach won it before. I mean, I mean, the, the Kings going from you know trash last year to what they are, you know, John. Yep. Uh, I mean, hey, 
<laughs> I mean, the teams made the playoffs this year, man. Right, all, all Pacific teams. You know, I, I remember the beginning of the year when I said the Kings are actually be, going to be decent. I was laughed at, you know, by multiple people on the podcast. So did I hey, laugh? Yes, did you did. You did. I laughed. You did. Yeah. My apologies. Did they make you it out the first did. round? Yet? You, Waleed, and John. Did they make it out the first round yet? Get a load of this guy. He's doing his rounds and shit. Hey, they play. They play in Golden State. They're not making it out the first round. Like, I, oh, I no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. But my point, I, I said, my like, point, tonight, I said, like, the, I said, like, the beam. I, I got, I got Sacramento in six. Okay. That's what I'm doing. I think it's going to, I think I it's going to be Sacramento. I said it on, I said it on, what was, what was Monday? Seven, yeah. seven in Sacramento. The crowd is going crazy. 10 o'clock game. Uh, honestly, I, it should be, it should be seven in Sacramento. I think they win. If they do win, it's at home. Fox, listen, Fox might be. It, this is a you said this is awards. He the best. He the best fourth quarter player in the league. I'm not gonna he lie, pretty to you. damn good. Um, I, um, uh, Kyrie <laughs> Irving. Hello, Luca. Like, listen, Luca's Ky- Luka Luka the Luca missed like twenty five games. Huh? Luca's the best first quarter player in the league. I will say that. that. That's a fact. He'll and he's at home. So. He'll go get you fifteen, and then and he'll then be gone 20. for three quarters. Exactly. <laughs> Irie's the best fourth quarter he's player like, in the league. He, 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 that away from him. he and the players lounge with the hookah. That's what he I'm, I'm, he, I might be a little biased best. because I, I say this to Phil all the time. Like I watch all the teams that aren't the top teams. Like I did the same shit last year. The he religiously really watches the Magic. It's crazy. Magic. I like. I watch the Rockets religiously. I don't like watch. I like watching the the good teams. But you obviously know what they're gonna do. I like watching the the guys that nobody pays attention to. Right? Okay. So I respect we that. We also have six yeah. man of the year. It's between IQ and Manny Quigley and Brock. Hey, I think IQ. I think IQ um, passed them. I might. Yeah, I might be biased, but quickly had him. and. It might be because he was starting towards the end of the year with Brunson out a little bit, but then like, he was open. He was going off. Yeah. Was and I think Brog- Brogdon being out, there was a, it was, I think it was like an eight game stretch. He had missed like four or five games, and I think quickly started going crazy during that time. So I think, I think it's, I think it's really close. I think Brogdon is a more polished player though. Like if, sure. you, had to, if you had to have a, it's Knicks and Celtics, and then you say six man battle. I think Brogdon going. He he'll he'll go crazy. <laughs> John only that's what I'm saying. I mean, I mean, Brock, I, Brockton, Brockton is like Brockton. he's an elite Brock, guy. He's an elite guy. But what if Brockton is like he, Kevin Martin on crack? I understand. He's a great guy. He's a great. <laughs> Kevin guy. Martin was good though too. Jump shot. He was. was still good, but like that's what he remind me of the lazy dribble. Just I hear it. Boring. Kevin Martin really. Okay, yeah, Kevin Martin. So John, watch Kevin I, Martin I, play I, big. I'm watch IQ a little. He was good. I do like IQ. I mean, I think IQ should win because he. I mean, he he stepped up as our second. He was our second thing to come off the bench. For us, I mean, he also started games as well. He did start games when other people were injured and other things. But I mean, I think that's a form of him <laughs> stepping up, and that's why he deserves a six man. Like uh, you said, Browning got injured somewhat this year. I think injuries, like in any awards, take an effect on players and how we judge them versus other players who shout did not get injured. The, shout out to the new CBA. Yes, sir. So, I mean, I've, been saying, I've been saying that. I'm so glad. Now they got to play to get consideration for these awards. That they, as they should. For. They said, no, I don't really care about the MVP. Yes, you do. You do care. Joker, you care. Embiid, you care. Greek, you care. I just don't think that the um 65 games, like, if you're going to take away somebody, like, from all NBA for not playing 65 games, like, that's a little crazy. I ain't going to lie to you. Don't Greek, miss 18. Giannis, play, out. Giannis, <laughs> Giannis played 63 this year, bro. You going to tell me he's not all NBA first team? You going to tell me Devin Booker's not second or third team because he but- didn't play? But sorry, I said that Kenny Kenny was saying this too. But also, I'm thinking about this. Some of these players went in there lobbying for that too, because they don't just go pass through anybody. The, yeah, the, but, the players' association has to be like, "Yo, yeah, y'all agree we with this, this?" Yeah, and then somebody they got around people the did. table. Great and they said yes, oh. and they probably no, they probably got sick of it. So I don't know. I don't know, bro. It sounds like Mikael Bridges is gonna get All NBA first team just because he played all eighty two games, <laughs> and he's not a he's not a for like I love Mikael Bridges. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> okay. I use this operation every week. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be in the gym shooting, right? Okay. Mikael Bridges is he's not a first team talent right now. You feel me? You gonna tell me LeBron or KD's not gonna get first team over him because they was hurt? You gonna tell me Giannis not oh, Embiid, Jokic? I'm, I think Jokic played sixty five this year actually. But nope. yeah, okay. Joker, def- Joker definitely nope. did. Joker definitely. I mean, did. I feel like Brogdon and I mean, if you look at the numbers, Brogdon, 
and IQ basically have the same. Oh, guy. well, we, we ain't talking about that okay. no more, bro. It's quickly, the six man award. Quickly is the six man, okay? How is he six man? He should be six man. They have, the six same, man. They, have, no, they, they have the same numbers and quickly had to go off for him to catch up to Brogdon. For take, your buy, take your bias out of it. I mean, bro, maybe, bro, fight maybe, back, the, Celtics, bro, fight maybe the Celtics <laughs> were the first seed. You know what I mean? I'm just saying. Yeah, Do we but, really think the Knicks were going to make the playoffs this year? Come on. Yes. All right, relax. You definitely didn't think that. John, I, I, I can pull back. I, 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 I can pull back the footage. Phil, I, can, no, no. I can pull it back the footage. I can pull it back. You should, you should find it. Where I, I want to hear you support the Knicks. I, it doesn't happen often. So I mean, I said, I said the Knicks would be a lower seed. I said, I said that. Oh, they're going to be a lower seed. That was that was after. I'm talking about preseason. Yes, before lower seed. All right. I can pull up my predictions right now, John. On the, on I, the mean, Excel I mean, I mean, yeah, it's on the Excel sheet. I'm just saying we've we've adjusted predictions. I'm just saying. Uh, if 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 quickly didn't go on that little small run at the end of the season, he wouldn't have the same numbers as Brogdon. So he, he had to catch up to get to Brogdon's number, not pass him. So and plus, I mean, you know, it's not two not six not man come off the bench. bench. He never started a game. So that that's just you know, by yeah, Brogdon. That's, that's, that's true. My opinion. That's true. Quickly started twenty one games for the Knicks. That that's why Westbrook Westbrook didn't catch up. That's a, that's a valid, started games. That's a that's a valid point too. Because think about it, if Westbrook was still six man, he would have won this award single handedly. I get that. I get that. But Brogdon should be starting. If he was on any other team, he'd be starting. Do you get what I'm saying? I mean, no, quickly is a young player. No, dead ass. If he was on any other team, he'd be starting other than the Celtics. Celtics have too much depth. I mean, not. What, guard, are, we, yeah. are we not? I, are, would he not start? Like, that, that's going to punish him for the award. No, he, I mean, but he's a starter <laughs> taking less money to play a six man position. I get you've accepted the role, but like you were injured. You know what I mean? Like, we're not going to punish someone for starting games because other people were injured and that's what a six man is the next one to step up are they not the first man off the bench off the bench not yeah starting. off the bench but to step to step up if somebody's injured you not who do you put in if you don't put in the six man if four or four of your guys are healthy and one's injured you know what i mean yeah i get that but that's hey, all i'm saying hopefully i mean there's a leak i put the there's a uh, like like around the season there's a lot of leaked votes apparently all the judges or the people who vote are like right down the middle so it's going to be a 50 50 toss so we'll see who wins that one yeah, I, it's exciting to see. I think they both played well enough to right. make it a conversation. Right. Next up, uh, most improved. I mean, if, if this is an SGA, then I don't know. Yeah. Who really? Lori. Most improved? Yeah, Ooh, SGA. Like, I, I got Lori marketed. Okay. Lori he, 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 he can be in a conversation. I don't think. It's, I don't it's, think it's, it's one like, of those two. I feel like nobody realized SGA was, he's been him. Yeah, but did he have a better season, like from last season to this season? To the what, was he, what was he averaging imagine, last year? Imagine, 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 like, like, imagine if the last Clippers year, didn't trade, trade him. Oh, yeah, I know. That'd be crazy. Um, look. I know there's a lot of arguments in front offices and people getting cussed out. Really? Uh, not, Over this? Not, yeah, they don't wait for anybody to develop. They no, just trade you. them. They just send them, and then they be upset when they're killing them. And let's just take SJ, for example. He yeah. went into he SGA went into LA. LA. He went into LA and put forty oh. something. SGA yeah. last year was averaging twenty five, basically twenty four. Yeah, and that, that's, that's averaging thirty two. Yeah, I was about to say he's been doing the same thing though. That's I, I feel like that's not no. I feel like it's Lori, bro. It could be Lori. It could be SGA. Right. Lori, I, I, Lori was literally going stupid crazy this season. Four or five like, threes a game. He's averaging like twenty. Was he how much he averaging? Twenty seven maybe. I can take that for you. I'm taking. I'm. I'm guessing, but like last year, Lori was not this. Lori's averaging 25.6, so 26. But last yep. year, he was averaging 14.8, 15. 26 and nine. He was on the, he that was, a huge jump. Yeah, I was about to say, and he was a uh, a bench. Well, was he? He was sort of like a six man on the Cavs, wasn't he? No, he was he a starter. He was a six think, man. Yeah, I feel he, like he was a six man. Yeah, because Evan Mobley and Jared Mobley and Darrell, yeah. yeah. But, yeah. But also, I mean, as the Thunder are in the plan right now. The Jazz are eliminated. I mean, that's uh, we got to take into effect that SGA will the Thunder team to the play in such 14, 14 to Whoa. 26. 14. Absolutely not. Time Who won out. most improved last year? Boys, can I can I take this for a second? Can I just take yeah. this for a second? All right, Phil. Um, I don't mean to use this argument against you, but since you use it against me all year, this is a regular season debate. All right. Playoffs have nothing implicated mm, in it. Talk Talks about it. Shove your words back yes, in. Yes, so I don't. Wait, wait. So, so you agree with me, right? You agree with me? I, I, if, if we're taking playoffs to account, yeah, I do agree with you. I think, okay. I think it's close. That's why I brought that up. But I, I think it, I, I do Thank agree. You. Like, I mean, I like. I think, I think he's just moved on to superstar. You know what I mean? I think if you, he, I mean, SGA. I mean, I think he's really. It's definitely I, between I, those two, though. I do believe it's. I think it was, it was a huge jump for Laurie Marketing, but I, I just. 
if, if you're taking playoffs into account, which you don't do. So like in this argument, you that's an L. You know what I mean? Like Laurie Marketing should probably win this, but like I think Laurie wins saying. this award, man. For regular season, I I, I think and it should be well, it should be counted. Lori played more too. Oh, yeah, because SGA got the whole tanking. He they did try to tank Thunder, but it yeah. did not work. They, they okay. literally forced him to. They was faking illnesses. He said health and health and safety protocols. Right. Well, it wasn't he Toronto. Just, he, just, yeah. he just dropped forty back to back nights two nights before. I'm like, what is this? And that's right. when I traded him too. Glad, but um. Uh, <laughs> We got rookie of the year up next. Who we got for that? Paolo. It's next. Paolo. Clear Paolo. Yeah. Paolo. The only other person that could be in the running is Walker Kessler. Yeah. He played really good. Imagine if the Timberwolves had him. They would know. That like the Timberwolves got blown out last night. But hey. Uh, he can he plays off. He can he plays he, his offensive game is pretty solid. And, and I'm pretty sure he's getting more blocks than Uber too. Yeah. This year. <laughs> um, you said so defensive player. Out. I think I had triple yeah, J, triple J, man. One of my yeah, favorite. Yeah, players. I like Jared. Jared Jared. player. My, yep, yeah, sure. one of my favorite players in the league. Jaren, Jaren, Jaren. He's gonna prove. He's, like he's, he's gonna show you why versus the Lakers series as well against Anthony Davis. I can't wait to see that matchup. I can't, yeah. And I, I'm going right to prize picks for his fouls and him and him hitting over. Oof. <laughs> him and AD a battle, if, man. If there's, a, a, if there's a prop for him falling out, I'm playing that shit every game. It's, it might be because I think no Price Picks been like putting up some weird ass ones lately. Dunks, yeah. free field goal attempts. There might be. Yeah, so, they, they, want, they want your I'm money. So jealous, yeah, I'm so you bring a prize, but I I hate prize picks. Yes, Fanduel has a price fix. Let me just say, prize picks. You're you're trash for not trying to put it in New Jersey. All right, if it's New Jersey's fault. Oh, Protection that's the what goddamn they, governor. It is. You can't. You can't oh, they didn't. They didn't give them enough, enough money. That's what happened. Right. Well, that's all. Out. That's all this is. It's about money. Right. Oh, that's, the reason, that's the reason it the, took so long. Well, because I can't make money. Thanks, Price Picks. The most important one. Most uh, MVP. Most valuable player. This has been. It's between three players. It's between one. Player. No, it's between no, one player. It's between How? one player. It's in Bede's award. I'm so sick of this. I still think so, Giannis should have a chance to win it. Okay. No, Giannis no, should be in the conversation, no. but he shouldn't win it. Let's just make that clear. Giannis was hooping. Do not get me wrong, but that the Bucks have a better record than the Sixers. That nigga had Drew Holiday, and he has Harden. Had Drew Holiday and Middleton. Are we Middleton seriously and saying that Harden and Drew okay, Holiday so are on the same level? Stop. Right? With right. Middleton. I got, I, got, I got one. I know, I got, but I'm okay. on the same team though. Giannis also had Brook Lopez. I got, I got one, I got one argument year. to end it all. Joker and then be faced in January, and he got 47, 17, and eight put on his head. It's over, it's done with MB and B. I would agree with that. Agree. The leader of the, the whole thing all season, then they face off, he got cooked. It's, it's a wrap from there for me. It's a so, good, valid point, very good point. They played each other. Then some Denver fans said, "Oh, they, they, he ran against when they they played in Denver. He didn't play. He would have did the same thing. He would have probably put fifty instead of forty-seven. Like, hey, I mean, it is good that beat does get one. He deserves it. I mean, Greek, is, Greek is Greek though. Like, it, I think Greek is gonna is gonna be to the point of it's gonna like that LeBron effect. He's gonna get the MVPs, but we're gonna look back and say, yo." He probably should have got that every single year from like here on, from the year he like won the chip. Like that's what we're gonna look back because we kind of did the same thing with Braun. You can say Braun is like the best on his team and the best in the league at a certain amount of years, but you just made me want to go look at Jokic's stats from that game, bro. That nigga only had twenty two eight yeah, yeah, nine, yeah. <laughs> bro, and, and then he another- shut him down, bro. Yeah. And had forty seven on the other all, like all that I've been, efficiency. I've been all, that efficiency, all year, so all that efficiency has a it has a it has a ceiling. The efficiency <laughs> you you can't you not about to have you not all about year. to go thirty five. You're not about to have thirty five, ten, and eleven. You're not LeBron. You're not Greek. You can't move yep. fast. Let's also point out the it's fact up. that a lot of the year Maxi was out. You feel me? Harden Harden is so inconsistent right now. Embiid has been low key dragging them, dragging bro. Who, who he, there was a point there. What listen, there was a point where he had Melton and Milton in the lineup, and he's on <laughs> eight game winning streaks. 
PJ Tucker, bro, doing <laughs> cardio, uh, straight cardio, taking, bro. Just taking, taking off oxygen in the arena. That's the it. Point where I think PJ Tucker's prop per game, his point. They had him at .5, nigga, because it was that bad, bro. This nigga was not scoring, bro. He wasn't doing nothing. Tobias Harris, the, like one of probably the the highest paid bum in the league. No, Ben Simmons. But I still, I still think it's crazy. This is this is my personal opinion. It's still crazy to me. Jimmy over Tobias. That, no, not even, I mean, not Tobias even that. Not even not yeah, not even that. That you sign a Magic player to a max deal. Tobias. <laughs> That's a wild concept for me to like. Soon as that happened, I say you just did that to a magic player. The last not, person, not the last Howard. person they did that to was Shaq, and he went to LA and then went for a three beat. You signed a magic player to that. That and even Aaron Gordon, Aaron Gordon got paid, but he's playing. He's playing much Wasn't better. No max deal though. Yeah, 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 yeah there was no max deal. True. true Bias was one of the biggest wastes of money this year. Him. Aaron Gordon said he's having his best his best career, uh, best year this playing year. Playing alongside so. Jokic. That's true. He's eating. But uh, I'm going to just be honest, bro. Like, this Sixers team, like, half of this team is really not good if we really think about it. Embiid is dry, bro. I'm telling you. He's doing he's doing his thing. Embiid got to drag everybody. <laughs> if, he, if he doesn't get this award, I mean, I'm not going to do nothing. I can't do nothing about he's it. A, he's, a, uh, he's a favorite right now. I think it's it's like – it should, that shit might we're be. We're going to start with NBA, NBA capital? Probably <laughs> Barstool Sports or something now? Come on, what's going I'm on? I'm not going to be fucking dent in that shit if I start watching it. So. Yeah. Okay. Hey, we'll find out. I think the awards – do they have, have after playoffs, don't they? Huh? The awards? The awards they give out the awards after the playoffs? During. During. Oh, yeah. Cause the, the whole post of them drag out the MVP award forever. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. And, and say they don't, they don't factor in the playoffs, but then they actually do. They oh, should. A little bit. Well, that's you know, me. I mean, and speaking of awards and players that don't win them, Bradley Beal, David Lillard. They're, oh, oh, I'm not, I don't want to stay here for this. I don't want to stay here for that. Well, then you shouldn't have signed that contract if you knew this was going to happen. Right. The Wizards and Trail Williams has been asked for I don't know how long, but you said, hey, I'll take the money. Maybe things will change. We get Kyle Kuzma. We get Dinwiddie. We get Anthony Simons emerging. Nurkic, nothing. They, I mean, they, they, I'm, I'm going to say, I'm going to say this. This is I always I always feel like this. Um I always feel like this even about the KD thing, right? People like I don't think people really understand like how stupid it uh, stupid of a concept it is to struggle on your own. In a I get that game. Well now, well now. For, no, yeah, I yeah. Oh, I always understood that. I I'm no, going no, no, in, but like I'm, I'm going in. No, I'm just saying. I'm just saying my perspective. Like, growing, I just can't understand how people can't. Like, you, yo, it's you, a team sport. I always got this as got a kid. You. Like, yo, like, I need, I need him on my team. He do that well. Oh yeah, we need that too. But like, oh, there's other people that believe in that this Jordan shit, where they think they can just do it by themselves. That shit is is loot. It's insane. No, absolutely. I, I Dame Lillard. What? How long he's been in the league? Eleven years? Twelve years? Yeah, yeah he's thirty-two. So yeah, about, about and he's had years. and he's had what? He's had two good years out of that. Yeah, and then I think one, a little bit more than two good years. He's only had then, one, one I'm final as, a, as a totality playoffs and a, as a team individually, he's insane. He's one yes, of that's what I'm he's saying. top okay. five. He's he's probably top five shooter ever, to be honest. I think if he wins, if he won two or three championships, he would have been in the conversation. For you know, damn well that's not happening. That's not. Happening. I know it's not <laughs> happening because he stayed in Portland. But what I'm saying is, like, if anyone has the right to complain, I guess, or asked to be let out, and it's I don't. And I, not and Bradley I, Beal. Bradley Beal signed a contract. I feel bad for Dame a little bit because he was on. He's almost there. He got. I know you signed that shit. He, he, no, what? I feel bad for Dame because yeah. No, I'm talking about. Oh, I'm talking about as far as like he had the opportunities to get. He was kind of close. Now yeah. Bill, Bill was just he just wanted the money. He's yeah. crazy. He could have left. He could have went to Atlanta, and I feel like they would have done more yeah. damage. Yeah, Bill, Bill's, Bill's, he's bugging. Yeah, could have gone to Dallas. I don't feel, I don't feel he, bad. Bro. He should. He should have went to Dallas at this point. Dallas would have. would have put in work. They would have a trade for Kyrie. If, it would have been insane. Wouldn't have had to trade for our best defender. You would have had a great offensive piece and wouldn't have to trade your. De- oh, that's been awesome. They'd be a playoff team. That's Granted, crazy. Christian Wood. They would, they would be, be a playoff, playoff team. team. They would be, uh, no, he, he, then Elijah will be stuck in this doing an ALS ice truck bucket challenge. Amen. Yeah, got to do yeah. that. Thank you, Bradley Beal. It's, for that's what happened this contract. week. It'll be recorded, I promise. Yeah, Lawrence. Elijah made a bet to himself in our betting group chat. If the Ma- Mavericks missed the play and says playoffs, he has to do the ALS ice bucket challenge. And they did, so. 
Amen. Wow. And he also made a bet that the Bills don't win the Super Bowl. He has to come in on the podcast with face painting on. I was going to happen. No, I got to make no it to the party scene. I got so you said the, the, bill, the Bills will never win? No, you said if they do, if they, if they don't win like this, like this, I had them win. I had them winning the Super Bowl this year, and I did. Oh, said if they I did not win, have them winning this year. For, I said if they don't year. win, I'll come on. I'll come on a podcast with face paint. It's gonna happen one day. I gotta make a trip oh, to Party yeah. City. Yeah, you yeah. might, as, you might as hire somebody because that shit is over. They'll never win. <laughs> oh Lord, just speak my language. They'll never figure that. Bro, you got, all right. So put think about this, right? Let's talk about that. This team. Hey, hey no, 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 no. Fuck out of here. We do a okay, basketball talk. Nah, fuck out of here. Y'all not about to flame me right now. Y'all not about to flame me right now. As long as they Stephon went, Diggs is there, I'm rooting for them. They right? went. They went four times in a row to the chip fans. and never here. won it. They're we are that's fans. the eighties, nineties, bro. It's over. It's over. We are Jet fans. It's okay. Okay, yes, we're Jets fans. Do not get me wrong, but you, I am one of the most unbiased people that y'all know. I oh, yeah, you are. You are. Sure, sure, sure. Stephon and Diggs my favorite receiver in the league. I say this all the time. I know he plays dude. for a divisional rival. My favorite receiver in the league, bro. Dude. Yeah, you talk a lot of smack about his cousin, though. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. His brother. That's his brother. Oh, it's his brother. My bad. My bad. My bad. His, brother. his brother's a bad corner, okay? Oh, jeez. Nah, he not a bad corner. But he not top five. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm not a Cowboys fan, so let's. let's corner, let's corner is that's corner is tough. Corner is tough. It's a tough. It's toughest tough position in the league. It's poppy. It's poppy. Uh, yeah, second it's, poppy. Poppy. it's it's whoever's talking the loudest at the at that point in that week. Yeah, well, that's pretty much what it <laughs> is. Sure. I think Sauce is better than Trayvon. No, I would agree. Mm. I think one year in the league, though, that's that's a little. Mm. You're, Yo, you're 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 capping at that point. Well, I don't speaking of like that. But, nah, I'm so dead ass. All right, time out, time out. This man just said he was the most unbiased person ever. Many, then said he was a Jets fan. Then said Sauce many, was top two in the league. No, this, oh, no, no, me being I'm unbiased. Saying, I as a Jets fan. How many turnover? How many turnovers did Trayvon Diggs cause? I think he had like twelve interceptions this year. This year? No, I'm, I'm talking about on this debate. that I'm one. On the one debate. season. You talking about another year? I'm talking about this year. I'm talking about what have you done for me lately? This past year? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> This past year, but it's all, but it's this, past year this past year, Trayvon Diggs. Right, so after, 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 after next year, we're gonna compare their first two years. Okay, I don't okay, think listen, I, do that. Sauce not, sauce definitely not that. a turnover like creator, but yeah. he has not had a touchdown score to him all year, bro. That's true. That's true. I Trayvon like let off a lot of touchdowns if we really be honest. You feel me? To Kendrick Bourne as well. To be honest, hey, sauce, the, sauce the, he defies the cornerback position. He should not be that that body build and be able He's to do, play as he well. He should not be this good already. Period. Yeah. You feel, like your first year in the NFL. Yeah. And I, I appreciate he, how he talks shit. He talks shit a lot, but it's also limited. You know what I mean? Like he was who is he guarded? Got, he, had, what, what, what he, had, he had the Chiefs hat thing was disrespectful, Hill, bro. You have but bigs in your division. I was also thinking about painting it green and making it a Jets she's at. So I was going to make it way more disrespectful. So, like, that's classless. On though. that issue, yeah, it is classless. I'm a classless, classless piece of shit. I am a classless piece of shit, but like, whatever. <laughs> Let's get it. I honestly don't think you should ever call someone a classless piece of shit. It doesn't make any sense. You know what I mean? It's like, like, it's like an oxymoron. Right. So, also, <laughs> also a team that will probably never win a, uh, a championship. Minnesota, they're breaking down. The people fighting each other, people punching walls like they're Mars Dodemar with the fire hydrant or extinguisher. Sorry, John. Um, it happened. And they lost. They broke down completely last night. So what do we do for Minnesota? Can I say this Nick? first? I'll just say this. They didn't break. Well, no, that I don't was, think they that broke was down at the end of the game. I think it was Ant's time to step up, and he did it. I don't think it was a breakdown, but he was. Yeah, he, he was shot, off. He was shot off three of 17 in the game. Nine points. Nine, eight, and five. Oof. Yeah. Like he shot three or seventeen for the game. I think that if he was making his shots yesterday, I think he at least half of them. Yeah, I, yeah, he just made not even half of them. Two more shots. This is a completely different game we're talking about. Here. It is a different game. Yeah. But Carl Anthony Towns also played well. I think he stepped up. Cat did what he was supposed to do. He did foul trouble as well. I think at the end of the game, like it. I don't know if it's clear in Minnesota, but this is supposed to be Ant's team. I almost, I almost say it's a Kevin Garnett factor. Do you know what I mean? Like he's a great player. He'll never win on Minnesota. They, they don't know how to put the pieces together around him. You know what I mean? Who and like, yeah, like hey, I, I don't know cat, 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 oh, cat. Yeah. What I mean is, oh, like, yeah, cat, I don't, I don't cat want cat playing a big man. You know what I mean? I'm just saying it reminds me a lot of Kevin Garnett. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, I'm not saying it will be the same thing. I'm just Boston, saying they'll, oh, they'll oh, never, man. they'll oh, never man, put it together for. 
Ant, Ant is my he's probably my favorite player in the league. Kermit. I, hope, I hope he gets out of there. He's gonna be another Bill and Dame. I don't know if he will get out of there if they if Cat gets out of there first. This is gonna max. This is gonna max him. Yeah, max, right. max, max. And he's gonna turn into Dame Lillard. Yeah, Max Payne. So, what do you think about the punch? Do you think that affects the trade though? If we're still talking about Minnesota, it brings the Gold Bears value down. Yeah, yeah, no, but what I'm saying is like they gave away two first round picks last year to get him. You know what I mean? Like they're not gonna get that in return. I know. But are are you traded? Like that's what I'm saying. Like is he, is Gorbler gone? Because of what he did to Anderson, uh, I'm just saying, going. No. okay, that's all I'm saying. Like, but I, I, I would look at the trade though. He he made he has he's what is he worth quarter, uh, a quarter billion, isn't he? Two fifty? I have no idea. I didn't give him Gobert? that contract. I don't know yeah, what Gobert got. He's worth two hundred, I think. I don't yeah, know. Shaq, I think. Shaq talks about this. I don't know, almost every podcast. Yeah, he's worth two hundred. 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 Yeah, he's worth two Good. And he's ba- it's basically he's basically slighting him though. He's saying he sucks. Yeah. The Jazz yeah. getting that much? Oof. God damn. I like Rudy Gobert, but like you can't punch a teammate, especially after you criticize somebody for punching a teammate. You know what right. I mean? Like, Draymond was with it. He was like that quick. Like I've never I've never been on Draymond Green's side so fast. I was just like, and security speaks, like speaks the loudest. What right? you mean? Like, like he said that about him, like after the whole incident. You know what I mean? He lived, yeah, he said insecurity. Um Speaks the loudest, something like that. Like he yeah, tweeted loud. that, and then Draymond tweeted it back at him when that happened to him. Which honestly, good for him. You know what I mean? That's that's not anything. If I was Draymond, I'd that's fair, fair, fair. I'd, I'd jump, no. I jump on a podcast and I talk about how crappy Rudy Gobert is. That's what I would say. Like every shit that happens in in practices is crazy. That's nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But still. just full on clear the room and let people box. And if you've been a teammate with Kobe, Kobe you Bryant, move, you move on from it. You see, you see what they're how they are now. Mm-hmm. They they still they still playing they still play good basketball they can't win on the road but they still play good basketball. Right. Well, next game's in Minnesota, so yep. You know who didn't play good basketball? The Miami Heat. They played like Dookie yesterday. Mm-hmm. Hawks. So now we have the Hawks and Celtics. Hey, How do you feel about the Heat? Hey, I said this the other day too. Hawks was winning that game, bro. I had the Heat. I was. I, was I, off. Too. I did not have the heat by a billion. I had, I had right? Can I, I say that? Heat. I did not have the heat by a billion like Charles Barkley <laughs> did. But oh, imagine they still come that. Did you see that? Oh, 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 Shaquille oh, oh, O'Neal was like Lord. Shaquille was like a billion, a billion. She hit him with a. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> but the, yeah, the heat. Do you think it's time to get rid of everything, rebuild, or no? It's it? not. It's really go not. To, go to C four in there. <laughs> I really just think they need a like they need a day. That's what I said on the a couple hours ago. Dame is. I think Dame would be the answer for the Heat to get okay. over that hump. You feel me? Or I, I forgot who else. Oh, I was talking to somebody about another guard that doesn't really have a market, but got to go. Kai. Oh, I, yeah. I was talking about this in the chat the other um, Kyrie early today or yesterday. Kyrie Irving is another player. There's like for the Heat. They yeah. They need you, a player. You just want him off of Dallas, so you can win. They need because Kyle Lowry is so wildly inconsistent. They need somebody consistent that's going to yeah. push the other. You feel me? He went off, but they lost. But who knows if he's going to have that type of game again? Like I think they wouldn't even have been in that position if they, they had a yeah. Kyrie or if they had a Dame Lillard. You feel me? They need someone to take over. You know, you know who needs to go there? Who? Luca. <laughs> That's the end of the last ever night. <laughs> Look into the Miami Heat. Put them on there. They got nothing but shooters. They got infinite hookah there, too. <laughs> Can they I got say this? Shooters. You got to listen. You got to listen with Luca. You got to play Hero. You got to play Duncan. <laughs> Come back you know, here. Drive, drive kick. Drive kick. <laughs> Can I say this? I thought I, about that just randomly, though. I'm about some bullshit. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> He turned his camera off. He turned. He said, Come here. <laughs> Why not? L- Luca won out now. He boy, no way, boy. I said there's Pat Riley, Luke, and that's hey, cool. there's no way you Luke, can blow that Luca, up. Luca, Luca, if you gonna go anywhere, my boy, come to Brooklyn. Luca, listen. Luca's looking at Bill. He looking at Dame. He said, "I'm not about to beat him." Luca, come to go to Brooklyn. Why would you? Why would you? Why would you, why would you, why would you say it to yourself? Why would you come to Brooklyn? Did you not just Hello? see what Kyrie and KD did there? Absolutely nothing. I don't care what happened. Kyrie and KD did here. I'm just saying. Luca, Spencer, Dinwiddie, DFS back on the team. Seth Curry, you got Mikhail Bridges Luka, now. Blossom, these people. Claxton, he finally would have a big who's consistent. 
DFS is back. When, when did you have to trade someone to get Luca? Yeah, Luca's under contract till 2028. Who would you trade away from Brooklyn, though? Would it be the same situation? It would. Think about it. They give up too much. They would give up to way too much. And you'd and have to trade up. Cam Johnson or McCall, one of those two. Way too. Mm-hmm. You'd, yeah, both of them would go. It'd be the same situation. <laughs> it, it, I'd give Brooklyn's up Cam not Johnson. the answer. Well, yeah, you would. I mean, yeah. Cam Johnson, is, Cam so. Thomas, and a couple first rounders. I'm not getting rid of Kale. I'm Why would you want to go to Brooklyn class. though? Brooklyn is just a horrible organization. Like it's they go. I mean, it's New York, but I mean, like, first of all, let me just say this: they had a big look. three and couldn't win a championship before the Knicks. Do you see how crazy? First that of all, is? that big three didn't even play together for real. I, didn't, I, mean, I like twelve games. I did not just say that. Like last, whatever our play. Let episode, me just say this: like, listening to me or something. What's going on? All the time. Let me just say this real quick. Okay. Fuck the Knicks. All right. All right, that's a fact. I, Fuck the Knicks. I got. Wait, hold on. I got to ask you something, John. Do you think? Yeah. Do you think the Knicks are gonna beat the Cavs? I'm hoping they go. They beat them in seven. That's oh, what yeah. I'm gonna, you don't. But you don't. He said, he, he said, oh, oh, you don't gotta be unbiased. Time out. 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 Time out, time out, time out, time out. I do believe. I do believe. Stop. If there's one thing you're not gonna do right now, if there's one thing you're not gonna do right now, is you're not gonna tell me, John Patrick Meyer, that Full name. I don't believe. Oh, I don't, Fight I don't back, believe John. in my team, and I don't believe. I Fight believe back, so John. hard. I believe in the Boston Red Sox in 04. I believe in the New York Giants against the Patriots. I believe. I believe. I believe. He has an underdog choice, person. All right. Let me just tell you, I'm taking the underdog. Mm, all right. I'm not preaching. I mean, Preach. amen. You know what I'm saying? But like, when it happens, the underdog is. It's. It's just. It, it it uplifts people. You know what I mean? So, I mean, maybe it happens, maybe it doesn't. Um, I'm hoping the Knicks make it out of the first round. It would suck to lose to Cleveland because of the Donna Mitchell thing last year. I, I was on a train going through Utah, and I get that text. And I'm like, bruh, please. You know what I mean? Like, And it didn't happen. And we signed Brunson, and the, the season was good. All right? You, and you Brunson, know what's crazy? You know what's what? crazy? All what? New York fans say that, and all roads lead to him killing you. Okay, have it, have it be there. Have it, I'll let, 30 it, piece. Let, it 40 piece. let it lead to there. It's, it's a wild, it's a wild story. We almost got him. Oh, damn. Now we got to see you think Cleveland. Do you think Cleveland's gonna go anywhere? Do you think Cleveland's gonna make it to, to the finals at all? No, okay. So, know. how are they gonna improve their team? It's Cleveland. Know. Who's going to Cleveland in free agency? That's Joking what I want to know. You can beat the Knicks all you want. Everyone expects them to beat the Knicks. In fact, if they don't beat the Knicks, that's on some people. You know what I mean? Yeah, that that wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm just saying. Time out. I'm just saying. If we're talking about getting rid of is nobody right? going to call him on this, what he just said? Oh, Who wants to go to Cleveland? On. Who wants to go to the Knicks? Well, time out. Time out. That's, that's, that's also fair. Who wants to go to the Knicks? No, no. You Carmelo Anthony. All right, here. 2013? Let's talk. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. 10 years ago. Who who have you signed? 10 years ago. 10 years ago. 10 years ago, Carmelo was getting ready for his first playoff appearance with the New York Knicks. Who is the free agent? I know. I understand that. Who is the free agent that they've signed? We brought in Steinmeier. I, I get Steinmeier is not that big of a name, but it's bigger than any name Cleveland's brought it's in. A, it's been a 10-year drought. Brunson? I understand. Brunson was a big name. That's what I, I mean. I, I think he was a big name. I'm trying not to be biased. Be minus. Be minus. No, 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 no. I'm trying not to be, like, negative in the moment. That's what I said. No, I, I'm talking about, like, the player that you brought in. Yeah. And I said yeah, Brunson. Brunson, he's, yeah. He like, he I'm not was, trying not to be negative in the moment. Did you just say that Jalen Brunson was a big name? I think he is. I mean, he's not for a hundred million dollars. He's like a B minus player. Hey, hey, he, hey, hey, coming, hey! He's coming from down. Brunson's not a big like name. B-minus. How are the Mavs doing in the playoffs oh, this year, Elijah? <laughs> Who played for last year? The Mavs. Yeah, bro, he wasn't 100. a big name, huh? Bro, he was yeah, let's talk about he, it. Elijah, let's you, talk you, about you it. You missed that big name. Come though. back on the thing. You missed You missed him, don't you? Because guess what? He's a playoff player. All right. And guess what? You do you miss Brunson right now? Look at Mr. Brunson. He do. A guy who would pass to him. A guy who would who would know his offense. But whatever. Let's just. He's not a big name. Whatever, man doesn't <laughs> man doesn't get enough respect. All right, he's stressed right now. Right, he's like, damn, I miss Brunson too, low key. But man, listen, he's like, oh, also, no, no. let's get into that. So these, we have a little debate going on and a grid because we're gonna skip a little ahead. So time no, restraints. No. Sorry, so me and Elijah and others have this little debate about Devin Booker being a top ten player. So I made a list for like twenty six right. players, and we we'll see if he number pass them or not. Before we do this, I'm going to walk back my statement. Really? He is not. You don't believe that at all? He isn't. There are there are 10 players I would take over book. But he's definitely in that conversation. Like it's definitely an okay. arguable statement. 
Okay. But I, I will walk back 10. my statement. I could take him at 10. You can. I would take I could take him at 10, too. That's all I'm saying. But <laughs> I, I would probably I think he's the second best shooter. I hate, I hate, I hate, listen, I hate D-Book, and I feel like he's top 10. That's all I'm let's saying. Go, let's, go through, let's go through this players then real quick. Okay, quick run through. So, number one, I think most importantly, uh, Bradley Beal. No, no, definitely not. No, Why is Phil so definitely fucking not. petty? 100%. Why are you so fucking petty? Why are you doing that? Why are you doing that, Phil? Why are you doing that, Phil? <laughs> Wait, y'all got to have him with Bradley Bill? Come out, come out. He is petty. That's the, exact, that's the exact player Elijah was talking about last year. And he, bro, he, why do you have to do that to Elijah, bro? Oh, he said, wait, he said Bradley Like, Bill I said, no, I didn't say Bradley Bill. This is what I said. I said Bradley Bill. Bill. If we're talking pure offense, last year, I believe he was top five in the league. Pure offense. Off at that time. He was going off at that time. He was no, not even pure time. offense. Pure scoring. That's what I said. He was scoring a lot that D- time. D book is that's what he do. But yeah, I D-book said that. Bradley Bill was top five in the. That's all I said. I, I have to throw that. I, I believe. Scoring. I believe offensively. I believe offensively, I believe offensively D book is up there. But I'm mm-hmm. not saying I'm not saying D book is better than Bradley Bill. I'm not saying Bradley okay, Bill is better gotcha. than D book. I just said last. I just year, up to that. This is what I said last year. That Bradley Beal is pure offensively top on um, pure scoring, he's top five in the league. That's my statement. That's why yeah. Phil just said Bradley Beal. He's really being bad. fucking petty. And hear me out on this. No, hear me out no. on this. This that was the start of Phil's list. All right. So he has nine no. other players. No, th- I mean there's there's 20, but I, I wish I speed run. Oh, okay, got uh, that's what we're starting yeah. with. Why you gotta be like that for that's what, <laughs> hold on. I, I knocked my headphones out by accident. Does Phil want to be an asshole? So, shit. Uh, I'm a, I'm, I'm we're starting with one. Bradley Beal. Bradley Beal is not better than D Book. He's comparable. Yeah, I agree with that. Guard, but still, I'm just saying. D Book is way better than Bradley Beal. That's Next. Fucking dick. Trey Young. Yeah. I'm taking Book. I'm taking Book. Can't take Same. For the simple, simple fact that. Jalen Brown? I'm taking, D- I'm taking D Book. I understand if y'all take JB specifically because of defense, though. I will take Jalen Brown. He is. He, they're very. I, I, I feel like they're. I feel like they're very similar. Like their offensive game, the mid range, the death, they'll drive. Then Booker can make a free throw though, and crush time. So yes. yeah, I would go. Sure. Down. I, too. Too. I feel like it's a defensive difference for real. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, Zach Levine. No. Book. Book. Uh, book. 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 Okay. Demar Derozan. Book. 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 Demar Derozan too inconsistent. Gotcha. Darren Fox. The book. The book. You're naming players that aren't even top twenty right now. Like uh, that, that, that. Don't worry. I'll get better. Bam out of bio. D book. D book. Jimmy Butler. Book. D book. Donovan Mitchell. Book. D book. Dame. D book. Who? Dame Lillard. Hey, this is Who's where it? I. This is Damian Lillard. Oh, Damian Lillard. Oh. This is where I coughed up yesterday because I was like maybe, but I think if you put D book in Portland, same shit. Yeah, so I don't see it. Book. I don't see the big difference. So I go book. Okay, I'm gonna say wash. Okay, carry book. 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 John Morant. Book. Book. John Morant. can't okay. fucking shoot. I know he can't shoot. Yeah, but yeah. He's so young. He, he, once, Morant, once, he, once he starts shooting, is 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 right. John yeah, Morant is sure. really one of my. But John's not there yet, so I'm taking book. Yeah. I get that. Okay. I'm gonna go John S- SGA. Ooh. If you put if you put book in OKC, yes, I'm taking book. I'm taking book. Yeah, what? Book is more of a playmaker too. Playmaker? Then more shoot of a playmaker than SGA, I think. Yes, he can. He can do that. Remember last year when Chris Paul went out? What Book did? He did do that. He diamond, yeah. Plus six, the diamond, low key. Six and six, eight and eight. He was going crazy. Oh, so he, had to, he had to earn his time oh. when he played Kentucky, right? He did that earlier this season too. When yeah, CP, bro. Like, CP I'm, went out. You, I'm taking Book over his SGA. I think I think it's really close, and I, I'm okay. I'm a little biased because SGA he up there in top five. He's my second favorite player to watch. So it's another thing. Book is a way better shooter than SGA is. That's true. That's a fact. That is true too. Like That's this true. is why I'm taking book. But don't get me wrong. That it, like you said, it is real close. But I'm taking book. Okay. Kawhi Leonard. This is where I'm taking Kawhi. I said this shit yesterday. I'm taking Kawhi. As of now, the book. I know. I know. Because uh, with I the know, injuries, I know. Injuries. Exactly, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say, 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 say Kawhi. Exactly. I know availability is the best ability. Yeah, I know that's what I'm saying. Like, that's that that's my big argument on that. Yeah, mid range is that guy. Mid range is a wash. They both automatic, and the defense is something crazy. Yeah, yeah. the defense so, really puts him over. But I'm gonna take the book. And he's been shooting the he's been shooting the three at a high clip lately too. He's been bugging. So okay, okay next one. How far Jason, will it take the Clippers? 
Ooh, that's a good question. Mm-hmm. Jason Tatum. We'll see. Jason Tatum. I'm going to Tatum. I'm going to Tatum. Not even available. Yeah, it's not as clear. James Harden. Book. 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 Ooh. I would. Oh my gosh! Spicy. I would much rather have D book paired with Joel Embiid than James. If Harden. we're talking James Harden when he was in Houston, all by himself. No, we're talking at about that Harden. time. I know, I know, okay, I know. But yeah. at that time, at that time, maybe. But no, current, absolutely D book. Okay, Luca. Luca. Mm-hmm. John Luca. I guess. I guess. I, like you guys did a while. I guess. I mean. I, I guess. I guess. I guess they I really hate each other. I love when they match up, though. I think nice. I think Lucas should have made the playoffs. I'm I'm holding that against him a little bit. I'm sorry. I know it's not his fault, but I, he has to be held somewhat accountable. Not he's, he's the leader of that no team. More. He's the face of that yeah. franchise. I did not um, like how he sat. I'm I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Luke. <sighs> it's tough. I'm gonna say book. I'm gonna say book. Devin Doncic, gotcha. Yeah, I'm gonna say book. Anthony Davis, book. Sorry, Anthony Davis, yeah. two glass book. shatter to me. Who got Lawrence? Um, book. Okay, LeBron. Look, LeBron. Right LeBron. now, LeBron. right now, I'm taking book. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> it's I'm hard. Taking book. <laughs> this it's dude, really this dude, still crazy. In the I league. can't. I can't. Like, all right, Braun is. Like, it's it's this, tough. To, it's listen. It's tough. There's it's no one who's tough. played his level. There's no one who's played like, his level yet. I'm like, it's really tough to like. We're watching something that's never been a 38-year-old that's really doing something crazy. Like he literally just had 30, 10, and six in a play. And a that's, ridi- that's ridiculous. <laughs> like, ridic- it's ridiculous at 38. He's 38. It, it's, and, it's he, really, and he's it's not really, playing against he's not playing against Michael Jordan anymore. He's playing against Tom Brady. He's playing a longevity game. He wants to play with his son. You know what I mean? So yeah, like the fact uh, that he's getting care of his body. It's I, it's it's real it's tough it's really tough it's, it's really tough and it's really crazy but I'm t- I think I'm I think it's the up. availability and then the age, you can see the age is hitting them a little bit so I can see, I'm not mad at that's why I'm not mad at that because that's why I'm taking book stuff. only because yeah. LeBron's like granted LeBron I think played two more games than book this year mm-hmm. but like I'm I'm taking book man okay. Yeah. okay last five Kevin Durant book over Katie. The best ability is availability. Okay. KD, sorry. Oh, All right, now I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. I'm stop. It's KD. Oh, oh brother, this guy. Sorry, that's KD, bro. <laughs> that's KD. Right. That's KD, bro. <laughs> we're about that's to clip KD, this bro. so fast. There is no, there is no what's the name. There he is just, no book. There's no book without KD. He just gets so much. He gets so much hate <laughs> nowadays, Kevin Durant. I'm sorry, he Kevin. The, he got, I really he, am. He literally has the playbook to score and to get to a bucket. Okay. Uh, <laughs> the next four should be a decent. Uh, Giannis. Look, I'm, whoa, Giannis. whoa. My fault, Giannis. Giannis. Come my, my fault. Yeah. My fault. It was an accident. It was an accident. It was an accident. It was an accident. I already know who the last four yeah, check, are, bro. Yo, check that monster. I can't with you. I can't. Yo, no, check that. He, he, he got monster. Let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. He needs to eat his Snickers. Let me see your hands. Is it like this or is it like this? Wait, wait. Hold on. Okay, that's yeah, a little weird. Though. That's a little weird. How you Giannis, said, I'm taking Giannis. He got the, he got the Red Bull and vodka in there. Taking Giannis over book. I'm so sorry. I said that shit. That was an accident. <laughs> okay, Jokic. Jokic. Yeah, said the Jokic. right name. That's on. Got you. Uh, there we go. Uh, Embiid. 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 Yep, and then the last one, Curry. Did we say Curry already? Curry. Steph Curry. You didn't say yeah. Curry. Yeah, I'm taking Steph though. What about Clay? You didn't put Clay in there. Why the fuck would I say Clay over? I'm not saying. I'm not saying. (laughs) I'm just saying he should be. He should be mentioned. That's all I'm saying. If you're gonna mention all these other scrubs beforehand, he doesn't deserve to be on the list. Fuck that. Nah. No, he does. Come on, he deserves. If if Trey Young's in there, Clay deserves to be in there. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Honestly, I mean, I I get you. You want Booker, but I'm just saying. Okay. And we have the main event. We got. We have a one-on-one matchup. Grit style. We got. IBT Lawrence versus Ball of Central Elijah and the NBA Real. Grid Challenge. John, predictions before we start? We think we got winning. It's a five by five grid. Let's take your boy. Just take your boy. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Take your boy. With the universe on the line. <laughs> with the universe on the line. That's being pointed. <laughs> with the universe on the line. With one shot left. I'm going to take Elijah. Of course, I'm going to take Elijah. Well, this is home field advantage. What are we talking about here? Come on now. <laughs> So this, this is a home game for me. You feel me? Man, home home game. Game. I love going places where I'm not supposed to be, man. Let's go. A home game for me, though. Yeah, I'll be checking. Oh. 
I'll be checking. I don't mind so, playing the face here. Yep. John, it, it, yeah, keep an eye on things. If I need you to check something up, I'll let you know. You so, see the diamonds in the belt. All right. Let me know when you, <laughs> you, know, you guys see the screen. I'm popping up, up, popping it up right now. Yep. Hold on, let me go full screen. Yeah, I can see it. Okay, so your top is five. That, wait, is this timed? Uh, maybe what 20, 15, 20 seconds each. Each okay. Fifteen, not, 15 you, seconds. Fifteen think, seconds. Wait, do you want me to be right. timer too? Yeah, John, be timer. Uh, I can check back. So fifteen seconds each. If you don't get fifteen seconds, pass on to the next opponent. All right, so let me ask you. Let me ask you a question, though, real yep. quick. When it says, when you see the teams on the left, is it currently on that team? It's, this is all time. All time. All right, good. Yep. And we just pretty much just got to name something. And you yep, can't so basically you can't repeat players. Yep. Uh, the names on the board will be on right down below. And take John off. Down. John's not playing. Is this? Take me yeah. off. Take me off. Yeah. This, 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 this is made previous. Yeah. So. All right. All right. Let's yeah. go. So the top ones: teammates with LeBron, musicians, first round picks, ringless, and all stars. And the one on the left. Cavs, Lakers, Celtics, Magics, and Pacers. So I'm going to get – who should get first pick? I'll, I'll, I'll let you pick who goes first. That's nope. the previous one. Lawrence, you go first. You're the guest. Yes, go okay. first. You got Lawrence. Start. Well, I just – what, what is it? Any, anyone? Yeah, anywhere you want to go. Start. Anyone? Um, I'm going to go – I'm going to go with the Magic um, for musician. I'm going to put uh, Victor Oladipo. That is a check mark. Yep. Victor Oladipo, the singer. All right. Give me teammate. Yo, uh, teammate with LeBron and Celtics. Give me Kyrie. Good job. There we go. Oladipo, Kyrie. We can, so only go one, we can only go one and eight each, right? Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Um, My name's Elijah, not Kyrie. You good point. <laughs> <laughs> That's a very good point. Sorry. Like Kyrie. I am going two things at once right now. One. All right, watch well, it started. Uh Cavs uh teammate. I'm gonna go with uh Booby Gibson. Check mark, Lawrence. Nice. All right. <clears throat> Ringless Pacers, give me PG. Damn. <laughs> Tragic. <laughs> 15 start. That's it. That's gonna be that's like super easy though, too. I should I, I didn't even pay attention to the patients being on here. Um shit. Hey uh musician. Um I'm gonna go with the Lakers. I'm gonna go Got with Shaq. Got there it. Go. Shaq Got it on the buzzer. Shaq Diesel. Uh, Diesel. All right, all stars pacers. Give me Tyrese Halliburton. There you go. Oh, that's a great pick. Like that's a great pick. Clock has started. It's a tremendous pick. Magic. Um, I'm gonna pick uh for Magic All Star. I'm gonna pick uh Penny Hardaway. All okay. Right. Good job. Getting time. Is that there? Yep. He made the he made the All Star, right? He did. He made the All Star. Oh, one right. Kobe. He, probably, right. he probably made one. <laughs> Definitely one who's with Kobe. I hope Kobe. I don't fuck this one up. You got six seconds. Pacers musician. Give me Lance Stevenson. Great job. Yeah, it is a check. Yep. What? Yeah, why, bro, why was I thinking of him? But I'm like, yo, he probably yep. Like, Lance, Lance was a musician. He yep, he definitely, some songs he definitely out there. did make some bullshit ass videos too. Yep, that's a, oh, I, that is um, true. Uh, Celtics first round pick, uh, Jason Tatum. Hey, I should give a uh, lots of bonus points for saying that. Shut the fuck up. Um, <laughs> I will beat you. <laughs> magic. I hope, I hope you lose, Elijah. All right, give me Magic teammate with LeBron, Dwight Howard. Okay. Oh, I should get a double point as well. Uh, oh, sorry, Lawrence. Lawrence. Need to put Lawrence. What the way you got? Nine um, seconds. Uh, Lakers, Lakers teammate with LeBron. I'm gonna go with Dennis Schroeder. Very good. All right, because he just made that big shot. Last he night, did. You know? uh, <laughs> Cavs first round pick Anthony Bennett. Oof. Great job! Wow, what a fucking <laughs> pick! <laughs> what a fucking! I had pick, to. I had to. Pick. Sorry. Uh, Cavs ringless. I'm gonna go with Donovan Mitchell. Great job. Oh, damn. Love to hear it. Disrespect. Extra points for you as well. Extra respect. All right. <laughs> Lakers ringless. Give me Josh Hart. Oof. Damn. Great one as well. Okay. Uh, can I repeat the answer? No. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. Fuck. Uh, oh, damn. I'm about to fuck up. Uh, Lakers, an uh, Julius Randle. First round pick. Perfect. There you go. All right. Um, magic first round pick Paolo Blanc. Blanc oh, great extra points for Bancaro, him, too. Manchero or Bancaro. Um, 
Shit. Uh, this, is a, this is a spicy matchup. Celtics, um, all star. I'm gonna go oh, with Kevin Garnett. Box too. Hey, yeah. great pick. I should have said Paul Pierce. I don't know if KG even made that shit. I'm not gonna lie to you. Once, once, once. right? Yep, Yep, once. (laughs) Um, Ringless Celtics, Malcolm Brogdon. Good one. Not not after this year. Probably still. Well, just like Julius Randle. Man, Lakers, Probably. man. Lakers All-Star. Kobe Bean Bryant. There you go. There go. Nobody said Kobe yet? Oh, oh I no, fucked no, up. No, Kobe. A little I bit. Sorry bad. about that. Sorry about that. Okay. Um, I wonder who I wonder who's gonna be I wonder who's gonna get this one. Musician Celtics. There's one answer. Five. There's only, there's only one answer. Four seconds. Uh, what the fuck? The clock was running. Ah oh, shit. Pacers first round pick. Right. Go ahead. No, no, you know uh, it's fine. Keep going. You, you, you had it on Pace first round pick. Who do you got? Pace's first round pick, Danny Granger. There yes. you go. That's safe. I was gonna say him earlier too. Pacers uh teammate with LeBron. I'm gonna say Lance. Oh no, you already said Lance. Oh no, no, you still got it. You didn't finish it yet. Oh uh, no. Pacers. Ten seconds. Ten Fuck. Seconds. Um George Hill. Yeah, um, that good, oh, pull. good pull. George Hill. Good pull. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, hey, that passes. Yeah, there's not, bro. There's not many though. I think it's like George Hill and Lance Stevenson. That's it. <laughs> yeah, both, wait, both of them are said. <laughs> yeah. Um, Cavs well, All Star. too. Cavs All Star. Give me Kevin Love. Okay. Gotcha. Um, Ooh, Magic, 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 Magic Ringless. I'm gonna say Hito Turkoglu. Ooh, Hito. Hito. Hold well, on. Let me double check. I'm going. I'm going. John, I'm, John, John, answer, the I'm going deep in the back. I think Hito Turkoglu won one. Let me check. Let me check. Yo, that might be that might be a, the first that might be the first wrong. What do you mean, Matt? Magic ringless. Let me check. He was with check. he was with Dwight and Law. Yep, it works. It works. Oh, it works. It works. Yeah. He didn't win one. He didn't win one as a sorry. We thought we were just nah, nah, checking nah, nah, nah. if he was nah, ring chasing. Nah, nah, he was right. two musicians left. I might, I might be wrong. Cavs musician J.R. Smith. Let me check. That might be a that might be a plus. Let's see, does J.R. Smith have any, have any music? I'm checking right Fuck! now. Fuck! I messed up. I messed, messed up. up. I, messed yep. up. I, messed up. I messed up. I messed up. I know the answer, too. No. Yep. There's no J.R. Smith song. Lawrence. Oh, I fucked up. I know the answer, too. Um, Damn, bro. Um, yeah, I know, oh, actually, I actually, you're wrong. J.R. Smith did rap. So right rap song. He has a song. That is a yeah, song? What is it? Yeah. Bleacher Report. So, so Bleacher right. Report? It's so, so right. It's a rap song, yeah. What the he, he rapped when he was with uh, the Knicks. With Carmelo Anthony. Check out So Right song. What's the name of the song? No, it's about his it's about his game. Never mind. Oh my Sorry. gosh, bro. Sorry, bro look, B- I gotta pause, y'all. This yeah, you gotta pause. Yeah, yeah. You gotta this, pause. This dude yeah. BI with 2.8 just hit a fucking three to, to bring them in within one. Oh shit. SGA oh, shit. SGA's going to the line right now. And I need him for two points to win 150. Ooh. He better hit both of these fucking free throws. So yeah, I don't I'm think the first flight to Oklahoma to kick him in his face. All right, <clears throat> go ahead. Um, Celtics, Celtics musician, uh, musician. Um, oh, this is gonna be the clutch one. Clutch get it. Um, I'm gonna go with motherfucking Jason Tatum. No. I don't fucking know. We already said Jason Tatum, Tatum too. Oh yeah, so I, I didn't, that, that's why I stayed away from the musician one because I only went All to right. the two that I knew. My answer: Cavs musician Iman Shumpert. There it is, Iman oh, Shumpert. Congratulations, good job. Iman was, and Tiana Taylor. I forgot about him. Good job. Iman oh, Shumpert. I forgot about him. So, uh, last, the SJ hit, hit, he hit both of those, I think. Yeah, he did. He did. Okay, last okay. one. Who can get it? Um, I'll give you a hint. Threw it out of bounds. I give, do you guys want a hint? Yeah. He's a current player. All right, cool. Oh, well, I know it is. I know it is. No. El Nope. I feel like I seen it on one of those. I see. I feel like I seen it on one of those corny ass um in in uh timeout shit when I was watching. Text me who you think it is. Hold on, let me text you. Eliza, your move. Celtics musician. Yeah, I know. I guess I don't want to go too great. He's a current player. Current player. I know. I fucking know who it is. I swear to God. Dennis Schroeder. No, John. No, he said he's a current. No, he's currently, he's currently no. on the Celtics. Yes, they are currently on Celtics. All right, I fucked up, man. Lawrence, you're up. Oh, I know oh. the answer. 
why am I thinking it's one of these bum ass three point shooters you got? You probably <laughs> make country music or some shit. That'd be hilarious, right? I swear to God, I, I'm I want to I want to say oh, that's, funny. Message. that's funny. I yeah. feel like I saw it. Oh, I got two names. Um, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say I'm gonna I'm gonna just throw it out there. I'm gonna say Sam Hauser. No, no. Nope. Marcus Marcus Smart. The go. smartest of Marcus's. Oh, I was gonna see that shit. It is the smartest of Marcus's. That shit, man. I was gonna say Lawrence. You know how I feel about this play. That would have been a dead giveaway. I, I fucking hate Marcus Smart. Exactly. So let's get the tally. The Thunder really won. That's crazy. Damn. Crest of them. Front the front office about to beat up uh, SGA when they get back to OKC. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I believe for Elijah. All right, double check. It's out, of, it's out of twenty-five. Five. It's out of twenty-five. Yeah. It's a five by five board. Go ahead. Ooh, let's double check. Three, five, <laughs> seven, nine, twelve. Yep. Ooh. By one. By one. By one. By one. Ball central. Take yeah, I had to say I stayed away from them. Uh, the what's the name? I thought I thought it was nice twist since you guys both love music. I thought it'd be nice, you know, a little. Fun twist. Yeah, I just don't. I just don't know all the all the people. I didn't even know he yeah. made music. Yeah, he has he has one song. Yeah, that's why he, he probably sucks. Yeah, it's not good. But hey, <laughs> I, I'm glad Elijah got the Iman Shepard. I thought I thought that was gonna be one of the first ones off the board for musicians. Iman, Tiana Taylor helped. Congrats on bringing home another win. I predicted it, so I mean, well, once again, I was right. So I mean, is there anything new, new on that? bro? Do y'all Congrats. see these hey. fucking stats for these games? I just want to point out real, real quick before you read off the stats. Hey, that's a fantasy football chip. You feel me? For what? That's a fantasy basketball chip. For you? That's a grid challenge chip. Nigga, this year is, yo, bro. Should have broke up with this girl. I mean. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, man. Don't don't start accrediting your success to her. Honestly, don't she probably that. was the reason why you lost hey. your two other bets when you think about it. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> I mean, is it? I mean, hey, bro. Chill. Chill, chill, chill. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm still in love with that girl. SGA 30. I was just joking. My bad. Giddy had 31. Oh, you mad at me? I'm sorry. 27. Okay. That's insane. John, stop fucking apologizing. That's crazy. So, we are here at the end. Last words for everybody. This was a hell of an episode. We got to talk sports and shit, and we got an exciting grid challenge. The one point win by Elijah. Good shit, man. Good oh, shit. Last words. How are we feeling? John, start us off. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling pretty hot, actually. It's uh the temperature in New Jersey is rising, uh, probably like everywhere else. But uh yeah, I mean we turn up the heat, we get results. I mean, it was a I great like uh, yeah, I mean, unlike Miami. So it was a great uh it was great watching OKC and listening uh to the podcast and doing the podcast and having that late night show and it was it was been fun, guys. I mean, I'm excited to hear what you guys are up to. Uh after next week, you know what I'm saying? We got big things happening. Right. Elijah. Terraform 2 tomorrow, man. Tune nice. in. Twitter spaces. Yeah, we'll make another sure group. to retweet that as well. It's another, it's another another round. Round two. Trying to get to this. Trying to get to this spread, man. Um, shout out. <clears throat> shout out. Oh, wait. oh, you do wait. You do the um the, yeah, I got a battle tomorrow. Battle? Oh, I got okay. a battle tomorrow. So I don't know if you I don't know if you know him though. Is uh he go by Molly Smith? No. Uh, yeah, he 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 battle he battles on the Twitter spaces and shit too. He's on TikTok and he has like his whole thing. I will send I'll send it to you after. I bet yeah, yeah send it to I'm exclusively on iBattle right now. So yeah, whenever they do stuff that I could get my hands on, I'm I'm here for it. But uh shout out Lawrence for that that great challenge, man. That was that was that was probably the best. I want to I want to Who got the nerve in pre-pro talking about, yo, I don't know if you're going to be ready. I listen, I'm bringing Hito Turkoglu out the bag. Bring it everybody. Yeah, yeah. Good, also, also brought some petty answers as well. <laughs> okay. Anything else, Elijah? Uh no, nah, that's it, man. That's it. Lawrence, what do we got? Oh man, nah, I appreciate y'all, man. Um whatever, whatever y'all need from me, man. I'm an ally always and forever. So I like, I like what y'all do. I see all the TikToks uh that's that's posted. They they're hilarious, they always pop up. With all the uh the trendy <laughs> the trendy uh the, old, the, one, the one uh the cap cut with the the guy from SpongeBob the seahorse I think oh, yeah is. yeah that's it is it's funny every time so now nah, I appreciate y'all for having me on tonight I'm tired as hell right now you're always welcome on but it, it was welcome. worth it though it was it was worth it though so so 
Uh, for me, hey, we're at 100. We're at 103, actually. But, hey, that we're, job's not finished, Kobe Bryant said. We still have a lot more to go, a lot more content. The whole team's ready. You know, obviously, Lawrence is going to give some advice along the way. And, hey, we're excited to see where this goes. More building, more content, more life. This team, we're going places. So, with that being said, audio down below, Apple, Spotify, Fuck Google Podcast, by the way, because they never upload our shit on time, so fuck them. Um, on, on visuals, YouTube, Spotify, etc. So with that being said, we'll see you next week. Thank you for tuning in.